Hello, board members. How is your weekend going? Well, I hope. Uh, it is Saturday, and once again, we start Pathologic Classic HD. We'll be uh, following through with our immersive, a.k.a. No Face Cam Horror Stream. They increase the immersion. So immersive. Um, last week, we managed to one-shot our way through... Um, we managed to one-shot our way through day two. We didn't die at all, um, which is saying something. Um, we did find out that random night muggings are not going to be a thing. Also, apparently... Hold on. That's odd. Apparently, uh, I'm having a small problem with the audio, because instead of playing through where it should be playing, it's apparently decided to play right on through the uh, wrong wrong screen. Ah, there it is. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. So much better. So much better. There we go. Get that turned down just a smidge. There we go. Ika, welcome. I'm doing okay. How are you doing this, this fine weekend? Hopefully uh, work wasn't too bad for you. I know obviously the weekends are a little busier, but such is the life of retail. Let us, uh, it looks like everything should be set up over here. How are we looking? Everything looks pretty good. Looking pretty good. Okay. Yeah, we are just about to start day three. Hopefully we got enough done in day two that things are okay. We'll have to get reacquainted with exactly um, what our mission was. Because it's important to understand what we did today. Because I know we, we got supplies. Uh, we're back. Yes, we're back. Um, as of today, my mission was secure. I figured out the most frightful approach. Be mad at Okay, yeah, today's the conflict. Right, we found we found official confirmation that the disease exists and is going about killing people. And everyone has gone onto high alert. Let's see, what is this, the House of the Living? Okay, yeah, and the House of the Living was just... Just me getting supplies for the, um... Shelter house? It was fine well, through work faster today, actually. The main menu song keeps getting stuck in my head. Wow. Yeah, like the that weird opera stuff you're talking about? Uh, or this, uh, do What is there to talk about stuff now? right here. Okay, and it is pretty late, right? Yeah, it's about 10 o'clock, so we probably hit to bed. Opera stuff, okay. Yeah, we can probably head to bed. Health is a little low. We should probably take... Um, I think one of these will give us some health. And this is for immunity boosters. What is our immunity at? Immunity is about half. That's not terrible. So yeah, we'll take one of these and then we'll sleep for tonight. Yeah, hopefully no sleep death. That would really, really, really oh, oh, that would be really, really bad. Uh, ten. Was that four? Yeah. Sleep. Our health is going up, but not with the consistency I like. So, the day is over. The time day left. is over. Oh. Your timely efforts allowed your supporters to remain unharmed. A new mime performance is being rehearsed at the theater. Mm, okay. And again, we were very dizzy. I don't know if that's the meds or... I'm having chest pain. There's something I can do for you. I'd rather you didn't. The best assistance you can offer is not taking risks. Is there something I can do for you? Right now, my only desire is to light up candles. Boss to soot off the roof. Wrap myself in bed sheets and get drunk until my mind goes blank. Then you get the bottles of Tyrene. If I do so, if, I'll do so if I find one. Do you want us to get drunk together? Who is us? If you thought I would drink Tyrene, you were mistaken. Tyrene is a rare potion. I always get it in the fattus. Factus. That's what the den in the hinder quarters is called now. It used to be the Golian Ken. 
Ask Audrey or Peter. Tell them it's for me. The Tins will go to the end of the earth to get it if, if need be. Maybe the or No, Eva, the orgy is canceled. I scrambled through a hard evening and an even harder night instead of me and is ahead of me. What? I like how the theater is still running when the pandemic is happening. Yeah, but it's also because it's it's lore related or, or like meta related, right? Uh, I'll try. I guess we got to go get Tyrene for her and we're very hungry. Uh, we don't have any food on us though. We have hopefully, wait, what do we got for inventory? Uh, we got $3,000 so we should be able to get some food, which we desperately need. Let's see how many muggers we run into out here. Let's see. Oh, there's one right there. Look at him. Uh, all right. Let's go get some cash. Whoop. Come on. Oh, I got cocky. Oh, what? Okay. Oops. Nice. Take all that. Still need some food. Intern man, away! From this <laughs> counter mugging. Okay, um, where is. Oh, yeah, this is. Is this something? No? Why did it. Hmm. Oh, yeah, here we go. Medicine. I don't need medicine. I need food. Yeah, if you mug the muggers, then the muggers can't mug other people that they want to mug, right? Where is... Hopefully this is an actual food place? Otherwise, I'm going to drink water, and that always is bad. Uh, yeah, I guess we got to go left here. Be on the lookout for more muggers. So I guess, oh, the other thing I guess we technically need to go is see if the doctor's here so we can talk to him about the body, if he's done examining it. Uh, I need food, I think, more. Oh, I can't get around this way, apparently. Oh, wait, wait, can I? Uh, I cannot jump over this. Okay, never mind then. I like that I can at least take the muggers in a, a pretty even knife fight. I think worst case scenario, I could probably do it with my bare hands, but I prefer not to. Serious, that's some serious invisible walls. Okay, uh, we'll keep going this way. I should have enough money to buy a little bit of food, at least enough to get me through today. Clothes shop, I don't need the clothes shop. Check in on the people while we're here. Okay. Ah, here she is. Hello. Changeling met Andre. Hmm. So that's how it is. Clearly, Simon has not reached the end of his earthly path yet. Hmm. Interesting thing to say. It's interesting that they're talking about the changeling. Um... I'm, I'm still curious if we're going to run into the other two playable characters while we're doing stuff. Muggers? Any muggers out here? No muggers. So I think this is the one where... Nope, this isn't the right one. This is the other guy. Yeah, it's this one. This is the older brother. People know death. We only endure it. Usually from New the climate has befallen us. The house in which Reuben lived and worked has been tranted by infectious mold and fallen prey to looters. Our messengers searched in every nook and cranny. Neither Reuben nor Simon's body are in the house. What? Some of the people that helped the under undertake the search are paying a terrible price. They contacted the sand pest. How would you explain that was in the body? It appears that once the infection began to spread across the house, Master Reuben decided to remove the body. He must have taken it to some hidden location that he considered safe. 
However, since we still haven't heard from him, we, we can only infer that Reuben is dead. We must still get in touch soon. Let's hope that Reuben was... We'll get in touch soon. The body was stolen, perhaps? True, someone could have stolen the body to force the family into offering ransom for his return. In that case, Reuben's silence and absence might mean that he is in pursuit of the thieves. Is there anything I can help do? Please help us recover the body, Doctor. We are already inhibited to, indebted to you for having identified Simon's killer. It's not your fault that the truth has turned out to be distressing to us all. I implore you to help Simon and, once, and us once more. Find my brother's body. All right, I'll help you. Okay, so we got another mission for today. Anybody got some food? Like, all I got is peanuts on me, which apparently I need to trade to the children. Yeah, I said it out loud, and that doesn't make it make any more sense. It's just that's what's going on now. All right. But yeah, apparently the body's missing. Great, 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 great. Wait, what is this? Oh, nothing I can take. Does the other brother got anything to say about this? Uh, is right. Whatever happens in the every hour brings us more troubles. I'm looking for the brother's body. body. Victor, do you have any ideas of the subject? I do. If I were you, Olaf's son would be the first person I'd turn to. Young Vlad, nicknamed Sharon. Reuben and him have had some business together. In this place, a room may, may have taken the body. Have you already asked him? I've tried, but he were in a difficult position now. On the one hand, we are putting pressure on his father. On the other, we're asking him for a favor. Putting pressure? I was under the impression yesterday that we had managed to put an end to all the students of early rolling families. Uh, there you can never be an end to disputes between our families. It's an, as impossible as reuniting day with night. But now I feel that Big Vlad's actions have, be, have a bearing on the root of all our troubles. I don't like the silence from the geometry. Could it be that they're in infamous murderers hiding? Others succumb to the disease. I thought we already come to terms with that. The thought has crossed my mind too. The term we write it conceded suspiciously with Isidore's, re Isidore's return from the steep and, other, the, and the outbreak of the epidemic. These I thought we already come to terms with that. Isidore has made this way into the town. Human or Shabak, it doesn't matter. We can't establish whether the involvement in Simon's death was direct or indirect, but the involvement is clearly there. Why? It has been revealed to, to Marie in a dream that the cause of Simon's death is hiding at the territory. I intended to find out why Big Lad refuses so. Adam to open it, and you should ask Vlad the Younger if you get the chance. Hmm. We finished up Dead State last time. Yeah, I, I mean, we put time into it. We got a lot of, we saw a lot of cool and interesting things into it. I'm happy to move on to something else. And I'm going with something very different than Dead State, like the complete opposite direction, but still turn-based. I think it'll be good. Good to do something else. Something else to see for a little bit. Uh, perhaps I won't even need to. Okay, yeah, I know where he's. I know where he's at. We got that done. Okay, anything else? Yes. Ruben's whereabouts? Sadly, no. That is maybe a secret. He is, of course, the person who must be blamed for the loss of our brother's remains. But that's not what matters. And what is? We have no competent people left except you. We're unable to put up a struggle. Is it true what I've been told that you decl declined Sabara's request and did not accept responsibility for the town's future? That I disagree. Not only did I agree, I explicitly stated my eagerness to do all that is within my power. Does that mean this town who understands medicine at all? There's a strange girl that I spoke to. You've probably heard of her already. She seems to be psychic. Is that the scientific term? I'm more used to calling such people witches. Apparently she has a gift of healing, but our, our conversation left me with a bleak impression. You're in a playing at age of decadence. Way shorter despite them looking similar. Well, that's good to know. I actually picked it up today. Uh, it was on sale, so I figured I should get it. Rock of the Savage Surgeon. I think the speed runs for it is not like five minutes long. Wow, that's impressive. There's also Barack of the Savage Surgeon. I wouldn't call him a savage. The culture of the pagan step the, does strife, strike me as too bloodthirsty, but it's far from primitive. If Barack is following its call, we ought to pay close attention to what's going on, what's going to do. Right now, however, he doesn't exactly have a good reputation. Culture infuriating. I never thought such a be a, okay why he is suspected of murdering his own father accounts of the bloody events of two days ago include a man whose description he matches i won't rule out his involvement in what happened at reuben's house that's interesting okay, okay excuse me i can i drink this tea uh, i've only got some water i need food badly 
Um, so we need to go talk to him. Let's go. We know that's closed. Let's go hit this one, and then we can go over hit this one and this one. One of these three or four here have got to be, and that's the town theater, so we can hit the theater too. So we've got to get some food in us real quick. Who knows whether he plays a speaker or a fighter in that module? Oh, fair. I'm happy to see that it, it, it you know, there's a, enough of a difference that it can actually change the play. Something I kind of felt with uh, Dead State was the leadership and negotiation stats were kind of, I don't know, underutilized, generally speaking. Fighting in that is super hard. Good to know. Good to know. Wait, what is this? Is this just, oh, I guess it's just a park. I super what I enjoy it. Yeah, yeah, I mean, you you seem to really like yourself some turn-based uh, tactical stuff. Nothing wrong with that. Uh, was it, I think I saw on, I was looking at GOG also, Geo, uh, good old games, and they had Tunnel Rats or something like that that was a DLC for Age of Decadence that was just um, fighting stuff. Have you looked into that? I think it was Tunnel Rats. I thought combat started there for a hot second. The music kind of flickered. Okay, so today we gotta find what's his face's body. Yeah, that's a little side module to AOD. Okay. Well, what are the prices like? Oh, prices are back down. That's good. Yeah, so those prices were just for that day. Interesting. Take the dried fish. Increases immunity by negligible amount. Lemons are considered a rarity in the region. Rich supply of vitamins and reduces fatigue, but increases. Oh, but increases hunger? Oh, that's uses. So the recent cows have been producing a clear ichor, and dark clots have been. Our animals cannot be trusted these days. big risk. I'm going to say that recently. Okay, yeah, so we don't want the milk. So we will take the, the other food, though. This, the fish is something. Yeah, that's not much, but it's better than nothing. We'll have to keep our eye out. Oh, can I take any of this, like, bread? Come on. Uh, no. Apparently, I cannot take the bread. Or that lemon. Budge. I'm working universal lore, and it's basically just a big old dungeon, or rather an escape from one. Okay, yeah, that's what it sounded like. It was just, like, do you like the combat? Then, hey, this is for you, sort of thing. Okay, let's head to the, th yeah, we'll go right, head to the theater, and see what that other shop is over there. Oh, I knocked on the, clicked on that door and got a gold ring. Interesting. That's. I wonder if that was a timing thing or if it actually had something to do with the door. Okay. Oh yeah, we need to take Tyrene to once her face. Is that actually body the mortal? Okay. So there's our mission, today's quest, and other tasks. So our main quest today isn't getting the body back. I think there may have some information. I need to know where the place room took the body and the location of other such places. Also, I need to understand whether the son of Isidore Baraka, widely known as the Ripper, has something to do with that. I should just make another module that mirrors what other continents only just mentioned. Oh, yeah, I mean, that's always nice to get some, like... Where's the... Hello? Where's the handle from my... Oh, there it is. Um, it's always nice to get some, like, extra lore, right? Especially in a universe you would really, really enjoy, but... You know, it's it's rare, unfortunately. But maybe you'll, you'll get lucky and you'll get like a soccer Sioux situation and they'll just suddenly out of nowhere come up with a, a brand new module. Ooh, what is this? An antibiotic that kills microbes and organisms and suppresses their their growth and slightly decreases the number of harmful microgens does not slow down the rate of infection. Unable to destroy the disease, but can have the level of infection. Slightly harmful to health. Oh, nice. So this can cut our infection levels in half. Oh, that's really good, actually. Yeah, we'll take we'll take um, one of these. That'll uh, actually, you know what? I'm gonna take two of them. I'm gonna take two of them. 
Yeah, that's super important. I'm happy I stopped in here and found those. That could buy us a lot of time. Okay, let's go go check out the um the uh, theater here real quick. Got to keep our eyes on the lookout for Tyrene. Uh, glass bottles. I guess that's good to hand to the, the drunks. I was really hoping we'd find some more muggers, but there's just haven't, we haven't come across any yet. They're good for, like, random items and uh, cash. I mean, they have, like, 400 bucks on them, which is, like, a meal. Rulers had to accept something was wrong. <laughs> I'm out for blood. Discoveries have convinced them. One of them managed to curb the family feud. Bad news. The governor will abuse his power, and the rest won't let him get away with this. Nothing's changed. The town was placed in quarantine. From now on, the infected districts will be locked down, and no one will be able to leave until the situation is resolved. Well, it won't be. They won't figure it out. Oh no, they put us in a box! I got a little bit of a headache again. Odd. Hello, weird guy. We find very few ungrateful people when we are able to confer favors. That was not a good time to talk, however important the matter. Alright, I'll come by later. I guess we don't get any more lore from this guy. Alright. We do get to find out that apparently the guy we gave the power to is going to abuse the power. Shocker, I know. Who would have ever guessed? Someone abusing power in an emergency? Unheard of. Okay, so we need to keep our eye out for Tyrene. And then we still got to make our way down here. Uh, so that was medicine. We'll hit these two. Hopefully, we can get some more food and Tyrene. Maybe a mugger. If we can find another mugger, that would be great also. Uh, that's this way, right? Yeah. What is this? Oh, it's just a close shot. That's not going to do us any good. Never mind. Uh, okay, we need to go back up this way anyway. Cut my hair today. I always feel weird having a lighter head afterwards. Yeah. Yeah, my head definitely felt different after our, uh, my recent haircut. You cut your own hair, you've said, right? Yeah. So do you just got like a... Like you do it with scissors or do you actually have like a, um electric trimmer sort of thing? Because I know when I do it, I have just an electric trimmer with guards and kind of have them just a set set depth. Electric one? Yeah. That seems like it's a lot easier than trying to, like, freehand it with scissors. Alright, what do you got? Smoked meat? Yeah. And fresh fish. But I don't have a way of cooking it. And peanuts. Yeah. I'll take both of those. Okay. So that takes care of that. The kids aren't out yet. It doesn't appear. So, okay, we, yeah, we need to go this way, and then we can go talk to the, the guy. I think the only good thing that we've got going on right now... Really cheap. Each chapter. And they're reasonable, huh? Apparently so, yeah. Um, So far, they've been very really reasonably priced, and apparently they traded the children for almost the same as a needle, so... It's a good way to get, I don't know... Bullets. At this point, we're a little bit more off, worse off for food, though. I guess if nothing else, maybe I can start trading these bottles of water and stuff... To, um... 
those thirsty people. And then maybe whatever they give me, I can trade for cash to get food. I'm super happy food went back down to a reasonable price, though. That's very nice. And I'm happy we found those those pills. Um, that's that's very convenient. These water fountains don't work anymore. Next is TP. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's kind of why I bought those as many of those pills as I did, is just in case, like tomorrow it's like, oh yeah, and the prices on drugs went up because they found out there's pills that can help you fend off the disease or whatever nowadays. Uh, okay, I do need to go this way though. I can only imagine. I can't. I I, I have to imagine something like that's what's going to be what happens next. I heard someone else walking there, but there's so much random ambient noise, it's hard to tell. Uh, this way. I'm so happy they included a map. God, it would be dang it would be so difficult without a map. Oh yeah, yeah, here's this, the drunk guys. Oh, we bought her. Oh, nice. He's got bandages and tubing. Five and five. Okay. I'll take both. Trade. Sweet. Yeah, those are medical supplies, and those bandages should sell pretty heavy. Oh, you are here. Good. Is the disease really contagious? Did he really just say that to me? Is this idiot really asking if if the contagious disease that wiped out the town once and could potentially wipe out the town again is actually contagious? What a complete idiot. Got it. He's a moron. I I don't know. Even disappearance disappeared. His home has been infected and looted. Neither his body nor Simon's was there. Where could he have gone? It occurred to me that the map with the infected areas charted on it would significantly help our count. Careers and medical aids. It's strange how neat the place is, considering the earthworks. Uh, I don't know. I haven't seen him. Do you suspect that Ruben is dead? Why should I suspect that? If Ruben were alive, he would undoubtedly make his whereabouts known. He certainly wouldn't keep quiet about the pest getting inside the town. He's one of the few who have an actual understanding of what the, that entails. He's known about the infection for a long time. We could... Uh, we just agreed to keep it secret. What? Is that what you think? Well, if neither Reuben nor Simon were dead in the ha dead house, that means Reuben has at least attempted to move to the keeper's body to another place. Otherwise, you, we would have had to surmise that someone had stolen two infected bodies, but perfectly obscure for pur purposes. Wouldn't you agree? So what is that other place? There are several locations where Reuben could have taken a course, but I have no plan to reveal them to you until you do our favor of... A family are favor in return. Unless it takes up too much of my time. I want to settle the dispute between us and the Canes concerning our our unwillingness to let emissaries into the territory. I don't know what the Canes are thinking, but we are not harboring anything or anyone that could be of even remote interest to them, especially to my deeply esteemed fellow Victor. Uh, Victor's in. Very well. Let's have it that way. I want to help. Don't you let the inspector? So why don't you let the inspector? First of all, it's dangerous. The rabble is rioting. It's really about that more than once already. Secondly, my father will not submit to the younger Kane's orders. If this keeps up, we'll soon be taking orders from his ten-year-old son. Okay. So what's? And this is not on the Kane's order. So what's your what's your plan then? Kane's are hiding something too. They have their own skeletons in the closet, and I've even wait. Right. It's even more unsightly than ours. Our closet is full of our own workers. Theirs is full of other people's children. What? If you can make sure that everything is well inside the polyhedron, then then trust me. The territory is fine, too. It's an enclave. A closed chamber. All right. Bunkhouse. Was the polyhedron closed after the territory? It was much closer to the original source of the plague, to Simon Kane. Sounds convincing. I'll inspect the polyhedron and talk to Victor, but I'll... I'll ask a favor of you in return. Help me find Simon's body. 
Try to curb it in the righteous anger of the judge and the terrible victor. They seem to have finally decided to harass my father to death. I have no doubt that no matter what he did, it's not his fault. If you do that, I will gladly assist you. It's the Canes, but I doubt, my, doubt that my success here can infringe upon your family's interests. All right, so... Okay, so he wants us to go... Um, find out what's going on inside the polyhedron. Okay, well that's doable. Was there anything else? Little son, as he is, has a cunning way of concealing his failures. He's agreed to provide the information needed, but only if the Canes withdraw their demands from his from his family. Meanwhile, I'll venture to assist that investigate the term territory as, as soon as possible. There may have some information. I need to know where the place where Ruben took the body. Location of any other of such places. I also need to send with them. Or the son of the uh, to do with it. Okay. It's interesting that the go get the the drink for her isn't part of the, one of my quests, but... So yeah, we gotta figure out... We gotta go check on the polyhedron, and then we gotta talk to the Canes about getting off of his dad's back. Um... Hmm. I think I'm gonna go talk to... Yeah, the lump. I'm gonna go talk to the dad and see what the dad has to say about all of this. Town hall. Shelter. And then maybe Eula's house? I just don't know how much time in a day it's going to eat up to do all this. Hopefully not too much. Unfortunately, we... It's hard to say what all they're going to need me to try to get done in a day. I think the lump's over here, right? Yeah, okay, I read that correctly. Wait, what? Why is my health so low? Is it because my hunger is so high? What? Yeah, my health is super low suddenly. Am I missing something? Uh... That's bad. Well, I guess when I when I take my nap today, I will have to make sure to take some more drugs to keep my health up. I hadn't noticed it was going down. That's super frustrating. All right. Uh, so there should be another shop over here. Do this. Talk to the father, older father. Then I guess try to talk to the canes. Okay, you've got more of this. I'm so low on cash, though. Hmm, well, at least if this is around, hopefully. I was really hoping we'd run into some more muggers I could take care of. Wait, is this the lump? Oh, it is. Let's talk to the father. Oh, this is the daughter. It's the same power. Would you like to meet me to reveal the secret of miraculous mother. remedy from the sand plague? It's standing room, mind you. Room. I'm all ears, Victoria. Have you ever seen an antique boxes with chalkier blush, blush powder inside? It has already fertilized in some of them. Have you already heard of the powders dubbed schmooders sometimes? His story from someone as honest and responsible as you appear to be. Uh, tell me. Powders are secret remedies that some people have been keeping since the first outbreak. Before it all started, one boy, his name was... Crowfoot, he died later. Inspired the children to play Epidemic. They were making those powders. Wait a minute. Are you saying that saying they used to play Epidemic even before the first outbreak? What is the first outbreak? Five year, years ago, a terrible disease broke out and engulfed several houses in crude sprawl. It burst into a blink of an eye. Like dry paper would. Every single inhabitant was infected immediately. Almost all of them have died except for several children who were courageous enough to take the powders the powders some of them stole various drugs from their for their game they chose the prettiest ones of course then they crushed those pills into mortar mixed them and wrapped the mixture in into the fresh leaves of fragment steep savory for safekeeping what i'm playing this mm, mismatch can help with the sand plague choose this very herb Story does indeed have healing properties, but that's not the point of it, of course. 
Beaker's brothers, for example, didn't wrap their powders at all. It was they who introduced the fashion of using antique boxes. That f the effect of their remedies was the same. These powders now. All over the place, some are stored in caches in, in the houses where the children used to play infirmary. The powders were l lethally dangerous to see. If anyone was to take that much drugs, it would damage their health horribly. The children begged to differ, like they always do. They helped once, so what if they do so again, in the line of reasoning? Hmm, I think you can see where they're coming from. Them the same. And all us am burning with curiosity and greed. And what do you think? Some of them undoubtedly help the poison of the body, true, but they also poison the sand dirt out. I have no idea how it works. Perhaps there are antibiotics in the, in the mixture? Heather is indeed lethal, and every single one of them is extremely deter detrimental to your health. I have no doubt about that. Thing is, the kids were recently remi reminded of one of the caches. They pried it open, and now they cannot cannot wait to test the inquired powders in an infected district. Loafer, Beaker's younger brother, has already gone to do this, the testing, the fool. Where exactly? To the Silent House, I believe. That is where the infectious began to spread from in the first place, besides. It's connected to the terrible man-eater story. Trin are always attracted to horror stories. All in all, I think you can stop them. If you ban the game, they'll listen to you. You are a celebrity doctor, after all. So you have a whole cache of those powders stocked up there, huh? Have a whole... They have a, probably only taken a few, but they know the places, so they will continue getting more. And getting poisoned again and again. It's a lottery. No one can remember which powder is which, what the recipe was. It, It'd be a cured or die situation. All right, well, drug loafer, out, drag loafer out of this, and perhaps I'll find a use for those powers too. Okay, so she wants me to go help her friend loafer. Apparently, interesting. So we got loafer. We gotta go we'll talk to the other cane. Still think this is some indication that these people come from the steep people, but all right. My chat freeze. Is that what's going on over there? Okay. Uh, the sinner. The Skinners. Yes, that was one nasty day. Wouldn't you agree? You're in charge of the hospital now, aren't you? I need a detailed report of the amount of potential drugs we have. Have to relieve your relieve your mind, doctor. We're distributing pr protective and permanent drugs daily among the town, so even antibiotics. Was that the drug agents from the list you gave us yesterday? Are you satisfied? If you truly care for it all, I'd be rather grateful if from now on my recommendation were carried out precisely and without superfluous wranglings. First, to have access to the confiscated drugs. Well, first, Let's see if it helps after all. First, oh my, aren't you a falcon? Please kindly spare me your comp comparisons to your blood. If I ever took it into my head to compare you to an animal, it would be to me long to an analogy, Mr. Vlad. Let's maintain proper business conduct. Sounds way too many crazy kids. Yeah, the kids are out of control here. Silence, you whelp. If you only had the slightest idea of what I had, what I've lost, and what I've given away to these people, the, the people whose interests you are eagerly defending, you would cool your adore. The Loxies, once the richest industrious of the area, are ruined now. Okay. This girl is dangerous. Have you heard anything about the river? Yes, I've heard the rumor several bodies missing from the cemetery. Nevertheless, I just realized a single person couldn't have done it. There must be several people. One man just couldn't appear in several places at once over such a short night. Well, you have a chance to see that for yourself. You should expect them. The butchers, of course. It's a no-brainer. Even the sickest jerk wouldn't commit a blasphemy like this. Some people are shameless enough to use a knife, but no one except for the butchers would steal bodies. It's dangerous and pointless to boot. Fine, I believe you. Fortune uh, turns all things to uh, yep. We're already busy starting it. Do you want to know more? It is it is the only reason why you came. I understand you're the person that keeps the native population check, and that's why I need you. Most of your workers are from the state, aren't they? Which you've taken. You think we ought to report report to you, my, doc my dear doctor, although there's nothing to hide. Our town has no suitable buildings. Someone suggests we find a hospital in an abandoned house, but the conditions... We need a hospital urgently right now. Where are the patients taken to? To the cemetery, dear doctor. The mortality rate is absolute. You're supposed to know that better than anyone, including me. The dying need only water and morphine, sometimes vodka, too. They can depart the, to the better world painlessly, then. Release us from the obligation to build a hospital. Report to me as soon as the field is equipped. I mean, you've already established the supply of substances required vodka, water, and morphine. I'm afraid that won't be enough. 
Be so kind as to do the following. Check every warehouse and every store that may still have medicine left. Confiscate anything you find. I'll check what we have in stock and choose appropriate remedies. Making drugs and selling them. Yeah, the kids. Yeah, the kids are definitely out of control. It's not a trivial task, Doctor, which will I have to resort to your personal power and the opportunity it provides. It was easy. I would have done it myself. To your personal power. I don't know. I'm trying to figure out... Okay, so that didn't help me at all. Look at yesterday. 34 people. Died yesterday, 38. Gone missing, 13. Total death total. Currently infected, 53 people. It all ends in less than 10 days. Day 3, in which the bachelor's offered to hunt the exclusive enemy and evaluate the chances of a nerve. Necrosis. Necrosis. Interesting. So wait, what time is it? Okay, so the day seems to start at 7 a.m. Which is really important to know. Okay, so we gotta go over to... This house. Uh, that's the silent house. So we gotta get over there. And hopefully we can find some kids on the way. Like, it's my brother, and I just did stuff like sell pencils and paper toys. I mean, you know, but do you live in a weird magically, magic, uh, in, like, industrial re revolution age? So I, I think, you know, back then, they just had a lot of, uh, different concepts of what it was and wasn't okay for kids to play with. Nowadays, we know it's not okay for kids to play with guns and knives and drugs and stuff. Back then, they figured, nah, bullets without a gun is pretty harmless. Right? Let's see if I can afford a little bit more food. Or sell some of my meds. Look, there's a long, there's been a long history of learning curves on how to deal with children. Oh, nice. How much is this? 825. Oh, I don't have enough. Um, yeah, what do you think? 360 for that. 45 for the... Oh, my God. You'll give me next to nothing for most of this stuff. Oh, 144 for the razors. That's not terrible. Um, how much will you give me for a bottle of water? 13. Wow, there's no difference between an empty bottle and a full bottle of water, huh? Good to know. Good to know. 360. I'll sell two of these, and I'll take one of those. Okay. Maybe trade with kids to make money? Yeah. Yeah, we definitely have to figure out, start making sure we get rid of, uh, see how much, because bullets we determined have sold really well, right? Pistol bullets sell really well, and they're the easiest to trade for with kids. I think this is the crazy lady who may be actually squatting in someone else's house. Yeah, lockpicks were sold pretty well, but we haven't figured out how valuable those are. We don't know exactly what they're for yet. Where are all the kids at? Oh, wait, wait. Her house is set up kind of weird. Waste too much time. I feel like we need to at least chit chat with some of these people. Yeah, it's the weird dominatrix looking lady. Okay, and I can sleep in the bed here. Changing has been seen in the tweeting. What could she possibly have to talk about? Any better. Oh, why did I just suddenly get... Dizzy. Okay, she's got nothing to say. Gotta keep moving. Ooh, a needle. Nice. Where are the kids? You should have bumped into like half a dozen children by now. How am I supposed to beat these kids up and take their drugs if they won't appear? Stupid kids hiding all their drugs from me. What's wrong with them? Uh, okay, what do you got? Oh, you got smoked fish and dried meat. 
Nice. Or smoked meat and dried fish. I got that completely backward. Okay, where are my pistols? Oh, yeah, here we go. 216. Yeah, they sell better than the shotgun shells. So let's sell two of those. Is that enough? No, it's not. Oh, I don't want to sell all my bullets, though. Okay, uh, that and... Um, I've got two of these, 270 or 50 for that. I guess one of these. Yeah. I can't afford both. Uh, printing a mix up. This is a stolen goods car. Just contains tomatoes, young on the roll, drives, or beans. All good for one's health and different measures. Yeah, we'll grab another meat. We'll grab another meat and call it even. Oh, yeah. I guess we can check the lockpicks. Yes. Um, 360. That's not terrible. Uh, I think that was on par with the razors, right? Oh, no, no, no. What is it? The gold rings. The gold rings also sell for uh, 360. Okay, so... Okay, we need to talk to them and see what's going on, and then we gotta check the quiet house up here. Trucking with them, check the quiet house. Just because uh, the, the little play we ran into today indicated that this guy's about to get really out of control, so maybe we can go talk to him, we can kinda s calm it down a little bit. Really low, the sprint button. Uh, what? Oh my god, is this the changeling? What? Yes. Then it's not. Only a miracle can save us. We have to hope for my hope for my girl. There's no other choice. Then it's not. Why? If that's the case, then our number is up. Then it's not. Why? Three ends, actually. And in three different ways, the town has been teetering on the verge for too long, pouncing on the edge like a ball trying to choose one of the three pockets. If it doesn't fall into one of them soon, the edge will rip it apart. The body will rot with bloody mold, and plague will devour the land. Simon's woven equal shares of love and hate into this town. His genius kept the feeling of those who adhered to the three different principles in check. He knew how to derive benefit from the, their contrariety. Now discarded... This court has become meaningless, like the town itself. The three-pointed ta taggler, taggler is frozen in a deadly stalemate. The town's fall is inevitable. Or what? Simon has built a puzzle. Everybody he bound were generally utopians or termites. But I insist that he built the town as a triangle, and so I declare loyalty to the third idea. The faith of humility. I am the mistress. There are neither heat nor cold anymore. There is only earth something not intended for my ears at all. This game is kind of... I'm a scientist and emissary of the powers that be. Prepare me your leapfrog. He says you make up your mind. Simon's death, you, you not... Untied the connections. People got loose like the stitches of a poorly knitted sweater. You know, the, of the three wills and the three ideas that adhere to. Someone will have to die whether, while other, another will live. Or will it be others? I suspect you will have to stay in the, stay in the matter, Bachelor Me. You become anyone's death. I refuse to become anyone's death. Be so kind as to notice. There stands a girl. Her name is Clara, and it's within her hands to tie our entire fate. It's fine if you don't want to help. She will make sure that new balance that arises is proper. How? Oh. This blessed girl has the power to decide who lives and who dies. She has the right. My spouse and I trust her. She's an emissary of fate. A guardian angel. Not a harbinger like I used to think, but rather a miracle worker. Let's just do she will hardly have the time to do much evil. Wait a minute, so what am I supposed to do? Keep in mind the three outcomes, please. The town is overburdened. It, it's filled with too many unnecessary things. So recognize the fates. Our future path will be decided by the new list of the bound. As shall the future outlook of our miserable little world. Speak to the dazzling Maria about this, if you will. Uh... 
I will. You're scaring me. I guess she's begging me to do it? Talk to Maria? And you are? See? Yeah, the changeling. I'm not trying to interfere with your work. Each of us has their own way. I shall see to it that people of Gobo's Tagler, who will of necessity have to be sur surrender their lives to me, will have given them in vain. The new generation will will not include mortal enemies. The new world will be built on universal love and concord. Darn, so that's how you talk now. Doesn't sound like your own words, though. Bells always ring sweet. So that's how you talk now. So did they know each other beforehand, then? Build a new world. Yes. Well, shame all those who try to play the, the antagonism of day and night, or of reason and, and the earth, for their own advantage. We'll exterminate those who've made the old... Olgoski and Kane clans, the ban banners of this war, will exterminate those who have used the power of the dream mistress and the will of the heads of the houses to fan the flames of the mi meaningless strife. To what end? Someone's going to have to cl cleanse away the filth. The party of the humble will lay itself upon the altar of the common good, and people will hate us instead of mourning our sacrifice. And those who take us will grow to love us. This is what will be. Thus say I, and the mistress heeds my words. Positive ring of miracle here. So how are you going to cleanse away the filth? They'll exterminate themselves. Everyone is at risk now, and death will will more than once raise its scythe over many. And that these days death is bound to raise its scythe above every link of the Taglar. And since we foresee these moments, we'll mercilessly mercifully save many from this terrible reaping. With your permission, I'll leave now. Hang on. Has Governor heard these this diatribe yet? Apparently not. Okay, well, we'll go talk to the husband and see what he's got to say about all of this stuff we just encountered. Okay. I think he's got a bed. But nothing else. Okay. It is a lot of words. A lot of rambling on. It sounds a little communist-y, weirdly enough. Um, but, I mean, I'm willing to chalk that up to weird magic talk as opposed to actual weird co communist no, propaganda. What are you doing worse, worse than, we are doing worse than ever, the infection is spreading. See that. Your wife says the strangest things. Yes, just our bloody luck. It's fine. There's always next time. Panic would be the least helpful thing right now. As we set up, oh, so he's in charge of this matter. He's agreed to provide funds and manpower. Talk to him. What about the burials? Who has assumed responsible for burying the deceased? I just didn't see a danger there for now. Towns people are coping on their own. Who, why does the interest? Why does that interest you? I need you tissue samples from one who died of the sand fever. Okay. I will restore the order here. Rest assured. What are you doing? Uh, why is a strange thing? Do you think so? And have you met Clara yet, Bachelor? Heard her described as a zealous person with a memorizing voice and hands that can heal any inflection. So it's true. Just had the pleasure. Isn't that girl a bit of a megalomaniac? <laughs> Grabbed as a zealous person. Claire really does possess unusual abilities. It's true that she can inspire love and trust at fight first sight. It's also that her touch is imbued with a remarkable energy, a healing power. However, the nature of that power remains a mystery to me. Uh, what's your own opinion of her? I've long been paying special attention to that girl. But I repeat, I still know nothing about her despite having talked to her throughout the last few days. And I cannot explain the facts that I've witnessed. You know, interesting to hear your opinion. Curious. Somehow I knew you would want me to run into her at some point. I just wanted to find out how well you know her. I've heard I've heard some rumors, and now by now, what local gossip is worth. Not to be ignored, but not to be truly taken litter either. If no one cares about one's sanity. Okay, and then. And his kind band together. What makes you say that? The disease is spreading quickly. The neighboring district is almost entirely steeped in infection by now. Even though the powers to that be have informed me that help is on the way, not that they're anywhere of the rates of spread, but let's not lose hope. We're working on it now. I intend to start studying the pathological culture now, which is why I'd like to ask your help. That This and that, I'm conducting certain observations. This is my private business on ruler. I'm going to start studying the pathological culture. What kind of help can I offer? I need equipment. I found out by chance that Isidore's laboratory was ransacked during the recent riots. I'd be grateful if you find the perpetrators and confiscate what they had looted. Yes, I heard that. They were being investigated. However, I would not call the dwelling a laboratory. It was more of a workshop. There weren't many valuables there. Still, I will let you know when the stolen ends are recovered. Thank you. 
That's okay, I'll make it. Yes. I'm made of wood. You're made of wood? It's fine, there's always next time. Okay, so that's about it for him then. Um, okay, so he didn't really tell me too much. I'm guessing this is... Yeah, he's a wood. He's made of wood. He... Whoa, what was that? Wait, what is that? Oh, we're going into the plague area. It's like, what? All right. These are buildings are infected. Areas are strictly off limits to keep out. Right in emergency powers, you must be informed by the governor on that. Uh, yes, sir, we, we were, sir. I apologize. Better safe than sorry. Come through. Keep in mind, sir, that they are all crazed, mad, and insane in there. Possessed if they attack you. Go ahead and run anywhere. Do not kill them. We'll have to intervene and beat you within an inch of your life. Well, they're innocent and in pain. So they're going to attack me, but not you. How in the world does that work? Well, you as a doc. We patrol people have nothing to offer them but a good old blow on the head. We want them out. They tried to escape. There's no denying that. They did. We taught them a lesson, though, and we're protected, too. Thanks to you. Protected? Yes, sir. They distributed them pills among us, told us those of your orders, told us that we're very much good remedy to inv invigorate the body. Bad for the heart. Also, they make it so that the blood doesn't curdle anymore. It rather fills the veins, making them bursty and thus shabby. Am I saying it right? I'm describing cataracter disease, in which case you were correct, yes. I'm be smart, mate. Just stand guard. Okay. Okay, so this is not infected stuff over here. It's on this side. Okay, so I need to get to the front of his house. Which is not this one. It's on th over there. I think I need, to, I need to go this way. And apparently I need to look out for infected zombies, basically. Great. But I'm not allowed to hurt them because they're... Whoa. Whoa. Uh, all right. Aha. So that's how... So by traveling in infected areas, we could run into these spore clouds that increase our infection rates. Interesting. So, wait, does... Oh, okay. Huh, so this does show us somewhat of infected stuff? Okay, so we do have to be very careful in here. Oh, it moves! They move, too! Okay! Interesting. Interesting stuff. Uh, okay, I need to check to see if one of the kids is in here. Oh, it's locked. We can't go inside. Okay, so this isn't going to do us any good. I thought they said the kids were going to go to the silent house, which is that one, but I guess not. Anything else? Got limits to keep out. What to barter? You have nothing to barter for. Okay. Uh, there's the powers. Protect it. Okay. So these just these all seem to say the same thing. Let's keep moving. Okay. So. Interesting. So that didn't do us a lot of good then, unfortunately. What are you selling? Oh, you literally have nothing to sell. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so... I guess we gotta go talk to the cane then. Basically kind of trace down some of our other options. What's her face lives around here too, right? Uh, we talked to her, so we need to go over here. We need to go back to talking to Canes. Side of things, he has all the data that might help me find that body. 
So yeah, we can't... I was hoping maybe talking to him would do something, but it doesn't seem to help at all. Yeah, so we'll go down this way. Yeah, fudge. Yeah, there's no kids out. Very frustrating right now. Well, we've come to this place a few times before, and we still can't... I wonder if we can get into it now? Nope, we still can't come in here. That direction, right? Hmm. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Gotta check these when we're here to see if we can buy Tyrene for what's-her-face. Nope, no Tyrene. Okay. Yeah, hopefully once we get over there, we can, uh... Make some headway with the canes or something. Whether it's the canes or the son of uh, Vla Vlad's son that tells us where we need to go next, I don't really care. Now see, there's this other broken heart thing, which is a bar. Supposed to be with it moving clouds like that. Yeah, I assume that's just. Uh, yeah, I mean, there's, there's, it was during that intro where they talked about, well, wait, what? I will shoot you in the face if you're infected. Sick, I'm in agony. My head seems to be filled with lead. My inside's burned. Could you please donate a couple of coins for me to cure myself and my family? I'll repay you. I'll spread the word of your untold magnanimity. Maybe about the local cemetery. You should have a rest. You're exhausted. The air here is determined to mental your health. Don't peace. Actually, my funds are also running. I assume I will beg the streets, too. Um, should have a rest. You're exhausted. Yeah, that's just how this place is. Every breath th threatens death. It's like walking through cost fire. Or simple fire. What can you do? We have to. We have to. Would you be so kind to explain what you mean? We're seeing outside? We're looking for food. We're hungry. We need to check out, out our, our relatives, see how they're doing. Technically, staying in is even more terrifying. It feels safer outside. That thing engulfs the house like it did five years ago. It doesn't just appear inside the room back then by itself. For instance, this is by themselves. I said stop scurrying away with unnecessary fuss. Okay, so... I mean, I should... I mean, I'm not allowed to, but I probably should just, like, shoot that guy. I'm guessing this is some sort of... They're gonna go with it end up being a magical plague by the end of it. That the Shen Bana or whatever is a magical plague or something like that. If I had to guess. Oh, I can go in here. Wait, what is this? What? Oh, is this one of the stash houses for the kid drugs? Hearing a lot of flies. Nothing in here. Okay, this was the kid's house. Okay. Okay, well, it doesn't look... Oh, a one whole penny. Yeah, unfortunately, it doesn't look like I guess there's anything in here now. Oh, what is this? Ah, our worn little... Woman like flowers, both little girls and lucrative dancers. Interesting. Oh! Hazelnut and bread. Wait. Is that him? Wait, what? Oh, we're about to have a fight. Oh, we're about to have a fight. <sighs> oh, yep, there they come. Oh, you gotta be kidding. Oh, my health is super low from the stupid... Whatever's going on. <sighs> all right, all right. 
that's fine. We know where we need to go, who we need to talk to, and who matters and who doesn't. It's fine. As soon as I saw them, I should have saved. All right. All right. So we kind of stumbled across something there. I'm having chest pain. Oh, let's get out of here. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, wait, wait, right. It's day two. I forgot. It's still day two. Um, so why isn't the drugs working? Like, they're not working the way they're supposed to. Take one of these. And then we should sleep. Our health goes up, but it slowly ticks back down, too. Like, it's fighting that uptick the whole time. The day is over. Uh -huh, and your timely efforts allowed your supporters to remain unharmed. Okay, hunger's high. Right, remember that. Think of something, of course. I, it's got to, yeah, part of the infection. Part of the infection. Just not making any risks. Okay, so she just stays here. Otherwise, uh, do you want to suggest I get drunk together? Who is us? If I thought you were drunk tonight, you were mistaken. It's a rare potion. In the factus. It's what the den in the hind quarters is called now. It used to be, it used to be Gillen Khan asked Audrey or Peter, tell them it's for me. The twins will go to the end of the earth to get it if they need it. Cancel. Them. I'm, I scrambled through a hard evening and even harder night is ahead of me. I'll try. Oh, is that like a quest for yesterday? All right. Oh, there's no mugger out here this time. That's weird. Okay. All right, so I'll try this again. I gotta remember to get in the habit of saving more often. Okay. Definitely wanna pick up some of that infection pill stuff. Yeah. Yeah, take two of these, that should be fine. That we gotta talk to the canes again. Then we gotta go talk to the son of that was weird. The son of Olaski. And then we can go check in with the judge guy. Okay, it was running away, so the new one is getting into Tyrene. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, so we check in with them. So it should be the younger one. The true way to be deceived is to think oneself more knowing than others. Oh, wait, 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 I forgot. Ruben's whereabouts? Sadly, I know the difference of Master Ruben fills me with the same as great. He is, of course, the person. Oh, it is. I don't know why I'm except you. you know, uh huh. Savage surgeon. Why? That's interesting. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. So we got that stuff again. Is this dis Okay, so that's just yes. So we gotta go talk to the older one to get more details from this one. That's fine. So we found where the body's at. By complete dumb luck. By me literally just clicking on random doors. We found where the stolen body appears to be. Uh, I call that a win, but I'm going to go 90% luck on that one. Most men are... What is it? Would you explain those ones the bodies? Or perhaps? Is there anything else I can do for her? Where do I even start? Some have seen something. I believe you made some useful on conversations town slums, not to mention we... Little lives here could then know something. Speak to my brother, Victor. He's much better than we're okay. okay. Yeah, okay, so we do that. So we talked to the to her, and I don't think she really said much. We'll double check just in case. But I'm still curious on why there was no mugger this morning. Did someone tell you to search the place you found the kids at or something? No! I literally was just running around clicking on random doors because every once in a while something weird will happen where I'll get, like, stuff from it. Maybe. 
And it was just a complete happenstance. Whatever happens in the tree. On the subject. I already asked him. I tried, but this is known. I think pressure. I was under the impression this is going to be disease. I thought we already confirmed with that. Why? Perhaps I won't even need to. Okay. Yep. Anything what? else? Yes. Okay, cool. We'll go talk to the wife. Or the... Yeah, I guess it's the wife. Okay, we'll talk to the wife, just in case. Okay, my health is still up okay, and it hasn't gone down in a little while. Changeling met Andre. Okay, please do stand. Okay, great. Okay, so... Okay, that takes care of that. Yeah, we're going out this way. This should be the clothes shop. Which we don't, we're not worried about clothes. Let's try this again. Grab the water, the three dollars. Go this way. I right, go talk to the canes. See, like that. I just randomly will check the doors to see if something happens, and in this one case, we actually went inside of one. My random door checking paid off. Who would have guessed? Okay, we can run through this quickly, though. This shouldn't be an issue. Yeah, we need food. This guy should have food. I wonder if this will be RNG. I, I wonder if it's set or if it's randomized. I feel like it's pretty randomized, but who knows? Okay, let's get in here. Oh, yeah, see, this is different. He had other stuff last time, so it is kind of randomized. Making bread while the little one's been like, you know, 11 cakes. Maybe there has been. Okay, so we'll take both. We'll just take it because the extra food, sweet. And we're going to need to eat it like right now. Hunger. That helps more. Okay. Our health is still up, but I think it is going down a little bit. Okay. Well, I feel like we're getting way less bottles this time. Okay, so we need... So we got to go hit the theater to trigger that. Oh, we got some bots! We haven't seen Lady Ica Or Lady... A lady's intra, sorry, two different names. Hold on. I'll have to take care of this one myself. Let's switch back to this camera for just a moment. Uh, I thought I could do this from here, but can I not? Ah, here we go. Block. And then report. Bot account, next. I think it's a bot account. Next. Spamming. Chat. Submit report. Close. There we go. <laughs> no Dragon Ball Fusion yet for you two? Well, I mean, you'll get, you'll figure it out. I mean, it took uh, Goku and Vegito a while to figure it out. And they're the pro tags. Like... I mean, most of us are just, you know, innocent bystanders in the background trying to give Goku our spirit energy so he can throw a spirit bomb, which is completely out of date and completely unrelated to anything going on in Dragon Ball Z or Dragon Ball Super GT or whatever iteration they're on these days. Okay, so we got to go hit this up. Got to figure out the Tyrene thing. I mean, Dragon Ball Z has gone a long way, right? Like, it's it, Dragon Ball is all over the place. Okay, no tiring. Uh, that guy's just gone. Hmm. What if that means it resets the world every time we come outside of a building? 
a fan of Dragon Ball, to be honest. I mean, back when I was a, you know, a teenager, I was a pretty big fan, but not these days. I think I, I watched all through the, the end of the Cell Saga, and I was like, okay, well, that was fun. And then I got kind of old, and I lost. Rulers had to accept something was wrong. The terrifying discoveries have convinced them. I think we One can we... managed to curb the family feud. Bad news. Hmm. The governor I can't will skip abuse this. his power. And the rest won't let him get away with this. Nothing's changed. The town was placed in quarantine. From now on, the infected districts will be locked down. And no one will be able to leave until the situation is resolved. Well, it won't be. They won't figure it out. And then it's just us in a box. This guy's got nothing to say to us. Okay, where's my health at? Yeah, my health is still going down for some reason. I guess it's just the effect of the infection. A man would rather say... Okay. Where's our health at right now? Um, we can try a bandage. Uh, wow, yeah, it helped us pretty good. I just wonder how, mu how much of our health is actually going to stay. Okay, we got to keep going right and then... Cause, no, 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 no. We were... Weren't we over here when we went into that house? And the house with the kids was like one of these, wasn't it? Wait, maybe I'm confused. That did a pretty good heal. I'm just curious on how much our health is going to stay up that high. Oh, this way, right? Yeah. Avengers are basically free if you find those thirsty guys. Yeah. And they've been around a lot. On basically every kind of day. As long as we have water bottles to trade with them. Would be great as if we could just have them drink the water and then keep the bottles and refill them ourselves, but we're not that lucky. I also do with another mugger or two, like that guy. Sir, sir. Oh wait, uh, ignore the knife. I just need you to drink my water, sir, sir. I need you to drink my water, sir. Are you thirsty? You look like a thirsty fella to me. How about you drink some of my water? Thank you. I accept this trade. Drink my water. Drink it. Drink it! Intern brand. Totally won't lock you up. You totally won't be locked up for drinking this water. Intern brand. I realized how that sounds, saying it out loud the other day. Just like, intern man. It's like, wait. Intern someone. Hmm. Hmm. Connotations. So be careful how what I shout when I'm saying intern, man. Be real careful with that. That's oh, another one of these sick people. Oh, mugger! <laughs> well, you all saw it. I tried to stop him, but it didn't work. Oh, wrong button. Ooh, another knife. Uh, and the sick guy didn't have anything on him. Yeah, but the sick guy didn't have anything on him. I got bamboozled. Shucks. Oh, oh, I got dizzy. Well, my health is, if it's still going down, it hasn't gone down much. Okay. Oh. Oh. All right, so I need to go this way. To get over to what's his face. But at least we got the money off of that, that mugger. And another knife. And those knives are nice to have. They do much more damage than me just trying to punch stuff. Oh, bottle and a needle. Score. That's basically like a free 200 bucks. Because that's what, like a bullet? I think handgun bullets are a one to one trade. I think it's over this way. It was weird that that mugger just came out of nowhere, too. 
And you all saw it. As soon as I saw him, I pulled out my knife and tried to chase him, but it didn't work. Okay, I need to talk to you. Is the disease really... Ruben's contagious? disappeared. His home was infected and looted. There's no... Where could he have gone? It's strange how neat this place is because the earth works. I haven't seen him do so that Ruben is dead. Why would I suspect that? If Ruben were alive, he'd do other things. Is that what he thinks? Well, if neither Ruben nor her are in the dead house, that means Ruben is left on an attempt to move her body to another place. Of the Stolen two infected bodies. It's the other place. Glad they let you. I'm going to settle this between us and the cane, starting your willingness, our unwillingness to let them in, especially to my deepest instinct, fellow Victor. Just let them hurt of all. It's dangerous. Okay, fine. What's your plan? Just kind of speeding through these ones. Love how you, so much of this module you just spend dumpster diving. Yeah, every time I see a dumpster, I'm like, ooh, treats. Um, like Homer at a party with free buffet. Just, ooh. Um, they're full of people. So let me make sure that everything is okay. So believe that the matter. Avatory? Uh, sounds convincing. Uh, it says something infringe upon your family's interest. Okay, so we go take care of this. Okay, so that's that. Now, where we should have been, because... I swear to God, that was not the one that we went into before. Town Hall. Because I swear we went across this bridge and, like, locked, like, knocked on this door and went inside of here, and it turned out that's where it was at. Okay, so we gotta go... I still need to go talk to them. This place is a dead end. And we need to go talk to his dad. So we'll go talk to the big uh, Victor guy. Big Victor, or whatever they call him, or Vlad, or whatever. Oh, I don't have any empty bottles, so okay. Got a park bench. Completely useless. Nothing. I am glad it should be this way, right? Yes. Okay. Okay, does that mean it's six? It is six o'clock, yes. The lights came on, that was interesting. Oh, medical shop. Yeah, we were looking for Tyrene. Yeah, everyone works, wakes up exactly at 6 a.m. apparently, which is interesting. And yeah, my health is holding. To be honest, if we get into that fight again, I'm probably just going to shoot those guys. I feel a current. Well, here's Victoria. I haven't. The story for someone as honest response was you. And it's been before the first outbreak. What is the first outbreak? So what's the special part of these powders? And, um, the sand plague. Her. And these powders. Now, I think you'd have to at least shoot one dead. Yeah, I don't think I can take both in a fist fight because they hit pretty hard. I mean, they're big dudes. Um, I think I can see where this is coming from when I'm in the same house. What do you think? I don't know. It's about that. Where exactly? To the silent house, I believe. That is where the infection began to spread from in the first place. And besides, it's connected to the terrible man in story. Children are always attracted to the all in all. I think you can stop them. I think you can stop them. If you ban the game, they'll listen to you. You are a celebrity doctor, after all. So they have a whole cache of the powder stock there, huh? It probably only took in a few, but but they know the places. So they will continue getting more and getting poisoned again and again. I will drag Loafer out of this, and perhaps I'll find a use for the powders, too. Okay, so... Okay. So Loafer's got to be over there, and it's got to be in the infected area. But we tried to go in that house, and it wasn't that house, so it's got to be one of the houses nearby. Who could have thought? Have you heard anything about the river? Who do you suspect then? The butchers, of course. It's no-brainer. Even the sickest 
jerk would con would commit a blasphemy like this. I believe you. Okay. Many so now, aren't you? Make some what drugs we have. Oh, uh, recommendation we create up precisely. This helps at all first. Oh my, aren't you a falcon? Please come in. Go on and find an angel like Master Vlad. Let's maintain proper business conduct. Silence. That's enough. Ron, do I apologize? Nervous atmosphere left me exhausted. This girl is Try the hospital, aren't right? you? Yes, please. Some of the measures you've taken towards, I understand you're the person that keeps the. Do you think we ought to report you, my dear doctor? Although there's nothing to hide. Conditions. We need a hospital urgently. Patient's taken to. I'm just to build a hospital report. Just Establish the supply of the substance required. Doctor, water and morphine. I'm afraid that will do. Be kind to those. In the storehouse. To my resort to your personal power and the pharmaceuticals it provides. Okay, so we hopefully. We upset him a little bit, which is fine, but hopefully we stroked his ego by saying that we came to him for help because he's the one with enough power to actually get this stuff done. Um, and we went across here. Yeah, she didn't have anything. Oh, we. Andre, Andre, Andre's pub. We might be able to go get the drugs or the 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 drink for her from them, and we gotta go talk to this guy. So we gotta go this way either way, right? Yeah. Okay. So Andre, Andre is Andre, Andre. I'm saying that wrong. Is is definitely the guy who runs the bar. So the other one is probably the twin brother who's the painter. Oh mugger! Let's go! Let's go! Come on, Mo! Come on! Yeah, you. What? He just. What? How did that work? What? I dodged the knife throw and then it one shot at me. What? Like it clearly went to my side, right? I'm not high. Like I saw it like a hundred percent off to my right side. I was perfectly fine. Well, I guess he is a, a crack shot who's also like magic. Oh my God. Okay, so drugs, we need one of these. Oh, thank you, ladies intra. Got another uh, little lurker bot there. Hmm. I'm gonna give myself a little bit more time and try five hours and see how that does for us. Okay, so it looks like it takes about three hours of sleep to actually get rid of about two thirds of the exhaustion, which is good to know. The day is over. Okay. Yep. Your timely okay, we're doing this again. So quiet around. Do for you. Uh huh. A new mime performance is being uh -huh. rehearsed at the theater. I'll try. Okay, good. I guess we're yeah, we're definitely gonna have to start saving more often. Okay, no mugger, but yeah, I, I didn't realize the knives were an insta kill, and my health was almost full. Yeah, we got bamboozled on that one. Um, what is our health at right now? Okay, we're gonna wait till it gets down to this like second pip there, and then we'll um uh we'll pop a bandage, and that seems to stop the healing or stop the uh, health from going down further. Okay, both of these, yes, I'm sure. Let's grab these back here. Yeah, basically, anytime we think we're going to go into combat, we definitely should save stuff like that, apparently. Because that was crazy. Oh, is that a mugger? Oh, that's a mugger right there. Okay, save. Uh, we'll just go back to day one, I think. We'll overwrite this one. Yeah. Yep, yeah, that's a mugger. Okay, he's going to throw the knife at me. Now, let's fight. Oh, two shot at him. Wow. Maybe because that second one was a headshot? I don't know. Oh, that's the church. I don't think we've actually gone to the church, but. Okay, grab the bottle. And a razor. Nice. The razors are pretty good. I think those sell for a hundred and something. Considering we can get them for freebies. Okay, we gotta go talk to the older cane first, and then we'll talk to the younger one. But yeah, anytime it seems like we might get into a fight, we might as well just save, just in case. 
problem is, is I think I have to switch weapons live in like real time. Olgimsky. What is it? That's been the to the body. That I've stolen perhaps. Is there anything else? Where do I even start? I'll let you know what I find. Okay. Where's our health at? It's not all the way down there yet. It's still slowly going down. But... Okay, we hit up the other cane. Yeah, we'll figure this out. We'll figure out what the, the curve is on this. We got lucky with day two where we didn't die once. But I honestly didn't expect a um, one shot from that throwing knife. That does it. I'm going to break soon. I'm looking for your brother's body. I'll talk to him. Uh, to him, putting pressure. Brothers, there's these. I thought we were. Why? Perhaps I don't even need to ask. Okay. And then the other thing. What is it? Sometimes not areas. There's all the power. Oh. There's also Baraka, the savage surgeon. Why? That's interesting. Okay. Good. Got that lore. Maybe. Yeah. Maybe because it was a headshot. Like. I mean, the angle of stuff is really, really wonky in first-person stuff, generally speaking. So maybe it was just it happened to hit me in the head and it was a one-shot kill. Where normally it would catch me in the chest or something. Because I was rowing downstairs, so maybe I, I adjusted my... As I was moving, I came down low enough that it caught me in the head instead of the chest. Crazy, but definitely not unheard of. And I just stabbed that guy. I think I got a faster kill because I hit him in the head twice. So, yeah, maybe headshots really do matter a lot in this. So it's interesting to see how sleep works, too. Okay. okay grab some food, and then we can eat. Hopefully, hopefully he's got, we are in our way into some decent food. Something decent. Oh, and a drunk guy over there. Let me in. Let me in. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Yeah, you got some stuff. Dried meat and vegetables and a fish. Um, we'll do both. And we'll take the crackers just for funsies. Hey, that's actually a better RNG on that. Yeah, I remember. Hopefully we can run into another one. I'm not dying right this second for bandages, so should be okay. Okay, so there's the theater. We hit the theater. Let them do their talk speech thing. I oh, I just found a hazelnut on the ground. Interesting. Yeah, so we'll go do the theater thing. It's dumb, but if I guess if like a, a speedrunner was watching this, he'd be like, oh, that's an interesting tactic for day three. Oh, oh, mugger. Mugger, no, no, no. Oh, he killed the lady. Oh, my God, he killed the lady. I thought for sure he was coming after me. Oh no! All right. Well, we're a hero now. Oh yeah, we might as well use the bandage. Um, yeah, that did a pretty good job. Okay, got our health. I got our stuff back down. Yeah, I, I saw that knife. I'm like, oh, I gotta juke him, and then he threw the knife at the other way. Okay, here we go. Five, and we'll take one of these, and yes, thank you. Looks like there's another one down there, but I'm not super worried about it right this second. Like, I don't know if it matters if I come and see this, but I feel like if I don't, it could throw off some kind of weird internal lore triggers or something. Okay. Oh, nice. We got six bottles off of this. We'll just save when we get out of here. That way we don't have to sit through this again. Something was wrong. The terrifying discoveries have Since I can't them. skip it. One of them managed to curb the family feud. Bad news. 
The governor will abuse his power, and the rest won't let him get away with this. Nothing's changed. Uh, yeah, I'll probably do RE1 next. From now on, I guess the question is, is should I try to look up an emulator and do the original Resident Evil 1? Or would it be better I go for, uh, like, the remake from the GameCube era? Well, it won't be. They won't figure it out. Because I think I own the one... I bought the one... Um, okay, now we're going to save. Let me just overwrite this. Um... I bought the one that's the remake with the better graphics and stuff. And I think it also adds a bit of, of actual uh, lore or module play. So, Okay, so we got to that. Now we got to go talk to this guy. Maybe that the bots are working. Yeah, do the remake? Okay. One thing I pro I might do um, is oh another mugger another mugger oh I dodged that by the way and the muggers are out in force how in force today jeez what's my health at oh, down to half back down to half okay well what does uh, this do. Wow, that did not look like it did much of anything. Okay. Oh, there's a drunk guy. I better trade him some... I better get a bandage off of him. <laughs> I better give this drunk guy some water for bandages. What? You heard me! Nice. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. One of these. Yes. Okay, sweet. Yeah, I think the only remake I might skip, though, is Resident Evil 3. Just because I've watched that played, and they they took a lot out of the remake. Obviously, the graphics are better, which is fine. Um, but a lot of the stuff that made Resident Evil 3 interesting compared to the other ones, they actually took out. Like the decision making, some of the areas were taken out. So I'll, I don't know if... I, I have to figure out exactly what I want to do for that. But I might... For that one specifically, I might play the original on, a, like, an emulator or something. I guess it's also, I guess I realized, just because we're out early, an hour earlier, maybe that's why there's more muggers around? Oh, whoops. Um, let's see what other kind of food we've got. Yo. We got some preserves. And get a peanut. Uh, I'll take these preserves and a cracker. Cool. Say hey, the early bird catches the muggers. <laughs> yeah, exactly. If you're not during out during mugging hour, then you're you're not gonna find the muggers. It's that it's like fishing, right? You know, you go at dusk or dawn. That when the fish are just waking up and are looking to get or, or are hungry. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Oh, I gotta go this way. And then it's like muggers. Muggers, you know, if you don't go at the and at, at the rainy nights, that's when they're out mugging. And you're just not going to find muggers. It's just that simple. Why do you think Batman's always up at night? He's not standing on the middle of like downtown in the middle of the day. He's out in the bad part of town in the middle of the night. He's looking for muggers. Okay. Grab some water. 15, nice. Oh, yeah, yeah, I forgot. I'm still injured. What? Oh, what? Whoa, mugger, mugger, whoa, where did you come from? Ow, you got a little... Come on. Okay. Oh, yeah, Batman's got to have a crazy amount of... Is there somebody else, or is that it? A crazy, like, amount of caffeine and stuff to keep himself pumped up. Okay, well, that was... Yeah, there were a lot more muggers out at this earlier hour. Before 5 a.m., apparently. Holy cow. Um, okay, rations. 
eat this. Wow. Yeah, we are taking a beating right now. Are you, like, murmuring? It's always very Liberty suspicious. And a, and a nighttime vigilante. Gotta eat a bunch of his time. Yeah, he's gotta be going all the time. We're gonna be gone. Why should I suspect that? Is that what you think? What's the other place? No time. What's your plan? Close to the term. Okay, okay. Uh, I'm doing this with canes. Okay. I'm not doing it for the scan, I'm doing this for the general good. Alright, cool. Well, we ate up all three of our, our bandages, but we've killed a bunch of muggers and gotten a bunch of stuff. So, is it worth it? Don't know, but we can always get more uh, water bottles for free and find more drunk people. They always seem to be wandering about thirsty. Okay. Well, then the music just changed there for a second. Just a hot second. Got me a little worried. Like another mugger already? I mean, at least Batman had... Yeah, thirsty, thirsty boys. Um, at least Batman had the advantage of having, like, body armor and, like, you know, tons of combat training. I'm running around with this idiot doctor who doesn't know, you know, a punch from a, you know, an elbow here. So now we gotta go talk to the other, other, yeah. Talk to the dad. Be on the lookout for muggers. Is that a mugger or is that a lady? That looks like a lady. Oh, I'm gonna save actually again now that I think about it. I mean, I'm kind of being a little cheeky with the savings, but I've had to restart this, what, twice now? I really don't wanna do it again. Okay, nothing, nothing crazy there. Talk to the daughter, talk to the father. The one Small ears. Eager. That's the first upper. Okay. Herb. It's powders. You think? I have no doubts. Where exactly? Sure, we're waiting to touch the horse. Do what I can for Loafer. Okay. Talk to the other guy. Okay. This girl is dangerous. The Ripper. Expect them. Fine, I believe you. Lucky uh, people love bad hands at correction. Not right. Yes. Yep. Yep. Okay. And then. Let's bring the. Okay. There we go. Got it. Okay. So let's take care of that. Now, we need to go and. Yeah, we need to go this way, and we need to go talk to uh, Alexander and them. And not die from a random mugger on the way there. No more headshots from those muggers. Get real sick of their nonsense. I mean, they can still mug me, just no to the one-shot headshot nonsense. This town's hyper-violent, by the way. If there was this many fatal muggings every night anywhere else, it would be like a crazy pandemic, like outbreak of muggings. It would be, it would be absurd. Oh, there's a drunk guy. Okay, there's a drunk guy. We gotta grab the. Uh... Oh, is that? No, I don't think that's a mugger. Nice. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. Give me one of these and a deal. Oh, that is a mugger. I think that is a mugger. Okay, hold on. Save. 
over right. Okay. Oh, wait, how much? Uh, too late now. No, see, those are no, those are just one-shot headshot or one-shot kills from the throwing knives. Just straight up. Thank God I saved. And those aren't easy to dodge. I was actually moving away and he still got me with it. You do need cover between you and the knife thrower, guys. Oh, I wanted to check and see how much, in, like, 44% durability. Okay. So yeah, when I trigger them, okay, then he'll come up. Oh, come on. I gotta, wait, why didn't I go forward? Come on. Okay. That's another one down. Oop, wrong button. It's not an easy way to get money, but it is a way to get money. Okay, talking to her won't do us any good. Guy's infected. Okay, bottle, bottle. She had nothing to say to us when we checked on her last time, so we just gotta keep moving. Check out this medical house. See if he's got any tyrene. No, okay. I don't know how much tyrene is, I don't remember, so. Come over here and grab some water. Oh yeah, there's the other one that we haven't. The other bar we can't go into for no apparent reason. Nothing. Okay. Because I think... I think we came around this way after we went to the quiet house. And it turned out there was nothing there. Which is unfortunate. Unless maybe there's like a back entrance or something we need to go through this time instead of the front entrance. Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened? What, whoa, what is happening? I guess that's got to be just a weird side effect of the drugs, right? Or the, uh, the infection. Otherwise, I don't know what else is, could be causing that. Oh, wait, is that the other bar? Oh, wait, I think we are at the... Yes, that's the other bar. Sweet. Okay. Go to the other bar and get the Tyrene. And after we go talk to uh, the younger Victor, we can, um... We can go drop off the Tyrene to What's-Her-Face and see what happens with that. Loggers in this town makes me think that these folks add something like, This is American's most dangerous town hit. You're living in it. Except for this mod, which really would be true. Yeah. 100%. Oh, the, the sick people are based off of the, the bar owner. Okay. You have Tyrene, correct? Oh, you do, and it's only 440? Using the boost immunity, acts as an anesthetic, restores strength during sleep. According to elder locals, critical doses of tyrene can alter the effects of the effect, and some of the effects are still unknown. I'm going to grab three of them. Pretty simple all breast and maybe hundreds of years old. The ring. I think I sold this stuff to him. But I'm going to grab both of these also. I think I have... Oh, I don't have a bone necklace. Huh. Maybe I sold it to him. I don't know. I don't know what to do with the bone necklaces. I'll take one just in case. Cool. So we got plenty of Tyrene now. We got some gold rings. We should be set. We should be set. I'm not going to stare at the lady too long. That's rude. Even if she is dancing. Um, okay. Okay. So that takes care of that. Now we got to go talk to the um, Subarovs. After we talk to the Subarovs, we'll save. Oh, is that a mugger? That's a mugger in the Subarovs' house. What? There's a Subarov on the grounds. Oh, yeah, he's going to go mug that guy. Yeah, run over there and don't just ignore me. Oh, the spin around for the headshot. I wonder if that means that there's like insta kill stealth moves. Oh, and we got another knife. 
What? Oh, my inventory's full. What? Well, that's never happened before. I guess... Huh. I do have an in limited inventory space. Interesting. Yeah, I have too much stuff. Um... I didn't think that would be an issue we'd run into, to be honest with you. Hmm. Riddle after about a half, about a half a hundred bl blows. Yo, you want to barter? Huh. Well, we don't know what those those are for yet, so I guess we should probably sell some lockpicks. Stack and you haven't been using them. Yeah, I guess I could sell some. I wonder, no, the bodies disappear when we we come out of a door, so we'll lose that one, but we'll sell some on the next one. I mean, I have three knives now. I could probably sell at least one of those or pay someone to fix it. Because I've I got, and I think, I've, I think I sold that other gun though. Oh yeah, you too. What is this? Why? Three ends actually, three ends actually, what do you mean? Or what? Explain what you're trying to say. Could you please explain what you're trying to say? Why the big words? Or I accidentally just ordered something else to my ears. Anyone's death? How? Okay. Speak to the Dazzling Maria about this, if you will. Dazzling Maria. Maria is, I think, the the Kane's wife, so I'll go talk to her after this. My little, you're scaring me. And then I'll talk to this one just to get to know her. I'm so tired. I might faint. To what end? Okay, so there we go. We got both of them now. Yeah, the good old psychic. Oh, that scared me so much. Like, oh my god, ghost! Oh god. Okay, everything's fine. Everything's fine. That wasn't a ghost. That wasn't a ghost at all, team. That was actually just a, a, a scarecrow. Oh my god. No, I, I can't stand it much longer. Uh. What makes you say that? Help. I need equipment. Thank you. For us, and thanks, and his kind a little hospital together. set up. Sand That's future. Okay, okay. I'll make it. Let's try to be the zealous person on the man. It's your opinion of her. It's curious somehow I knew you would want to bring to Renner in some way. Some rumors. Okay, got, got that stuff done. There was nothing up here for me to snag, right? Okay. Okay. Okay, so let's go and double check. I'm gonna save again real quick. Um, I'm gonna go double check this. Uh, double check this area out and see if... Oh. Oh, we can go into some of these infected houses. Oh, whoa, what? Uh, oh. oh, it's still coming right for me here. Uh, hello? Oh my god, okay. So maybe that's what it was. It wasn't that. I gotta take all of them individually. So maybe it wasn't that guy gave it to me. It just comes down the stairs? Uh, and yeah, it just comes down the stairs apparently. Okay. I was mostly looking to see if, if there, 
Okay, if there was actual, like, drug caches in these buildings. More so than just to loot them. Like, the stoves are weirdly modern looking compared to a lot of the other stuff. Why are the beds up like that? No bodies, though, which is a nice, nice to see. Okay. And I'm not seeing any drug stashes. Okay. I don't know what direction that's going. That's a long one. Is... Uh, oh. oh, jump! No, oh, son of a... What am I... Oh. Well, I got bamboozled. Son of a gun. Oh, I'm out of oil. Here's a dead person. Huh? Wait. Oh, I can give them stuff. Oh. Interesting. Sure, have one of those. I'm gonna have to take some pills to get my immunity pack up. I wasn't really trying to loot this stuff. I was more looking for... Oh, come on, again? Let's get out of here. No, come on. Great. I gotta get out of the freaking house. And I'm stuck on something again. Oh, just a giant rat. Okay, that's different. Yeah, apparently it's not. I was hoping we could find one of the drug caches or something, but nope. Okay, um... So... What's my health at? Health is about half. So we're gonna need to do... Let's see. It's taking my health down a little bit, but not too much. Oh, we found some more of this, though. So we did find some of this in there. Just take that to get our health back up. Okay. We take we have the infection pill, so we're good on that, I guess, for right now too. So yeah, it's I don't know how much of it's worth it to actually go in there. Well, that's not a drunk guy, but he can fix our knife. Now that it's daytime, the mugger should be gone, I think. Wait, what is this guy? Uh, yo? Can I? I cannot talk to you. Whoa. Oh, I don't know what this person's doing, but I don't like it. They're like infecting me or something. Nope. I think getting another Schmutter was kind of worth it. Yeah, that might have been worth it if we got another one. Luckily, we were able to buy that Tyrene, which I think it said also boosts your immunity. Yeah, that 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 guy was definitely doing kind of weird voodoo magic for sure. Okay, so going into the infected district didn't really help us much. Um, talk to both of them. Oh yeah, we got to talk to Maria. Do I believe? Yeah, we got to go talk to Maria. The shelter. Yeah, we got to. We'll go talk to her. See if she's got any words of wisdom for today. D 
then we'll go talk to Maria and the Canes, hit uh, Yana on the way back, and then go go talk to uh, young Victor. See, I swear it was coming over this bridge, headed in this direction, and I clicked on like one of the doors on this building over here, and I just sort of went inside? Yeah, it's this one. Right here. This is not where the kids were hanging out because I remember we found them next to this. It was like one of these buildings. I just completely lucked into the answer, one of the answers to this. Um. Mm, mm, save. Yeah, it was just complete dumb luck. I knocked on the right random door that let me in to find the answer. Oh, hello, ladies intro. Welcome. How are you doing? Oh, wait. Okay, there's her house. I need another drunk guy to buy bandages from. Usually, they're all over the place, but I guess now that the town's gone into lockdown, there are not as many around. Well, Zentra, I don't know how much, if you've been paying too much attention, but uh, we've gotten some really weird stuff happening. It turns out I just kind of wandered into the correct building. Sponsored by mugging! Are, are, have you been mugged? Carry a knife. Counter mug. There are unseen connections. I have a terrible headache, but it's still past. Okay, she has nothing to say to us. Okay, so that's that's two. That's a couple people down we know we don't need to talk to right now. Yeah, we, uh, we've died twice. Well, three times, but two times that mattered. Uh, we got punched out by some guys that we were not expecting to get into a fight with. We just completely stumbled across. And then we got, like, it turns out the muggers, their knives are one-shot kills if they hit you with the throwing knife, which we did not, I didn't realize before. So, um, in the last, we've, we've restarted this day a couple of times now, and we found that uh, muggers are definitely more prevalent before, like, 5 a.m., which is interesting. And, um, oh yeah, I forgot my knife somewhere broke. And they are super prevalent. Holy cow. Um, take a couple of these. Oh yeah, 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 sell stuff. Right, right, while we're here. Um, we wanted to sell lock picks, right? Because we don't know what to do with them, and they're filling up our inventory. Yeah, 360, so... We'll sell two of them and keep one around for emergencies, just in case we need to do something really, really crazy with it. And we've got two knives. we got one... Okay, so we've got two that aren't equipped. Oh, yeah, yeah, here's the other one down here on the, the equipped list. And sell that. $3... 360. Wait, 360? I think we bought it for less than that. That might have been a straight up win. Yeah, we haven't run into any kids today. I forgot about that. There's no kids out on the streets right now for some reason. Nearly broken knife sells for about half of a fully repaired one. Yeah, it's a little weird. 720. And this one was 388. Yeah. Hmm. You think I want to sell the broken one? I guess then. Hmm. I'll just hang on to him. I can sell him later. It's not like this guy's giving me top dollar for him or anything. Twenty three hundred for a thirty percent. A hundred spent is thirty six. Wow, that's actually better than fifty percent. Interesting. All right. Wait. Will he not? Okay, he will just give me the money. I was like, wait, will he not give me money for those? But he will. Okay, cool. Um, okay, I can't get water out of that like I thought. It's fine. But yeah, ladies intro. Then we also happen to come across, um, just completely out of nowhere, one of the solutions to today's problem. By, by active, I just completely accidentally clicked on a random door as I was running by and it led us inside. They say changing has been to honest. Right? 
Uh, that all. Prison's, uh, prison's been destroyed, right? It was the infected meat that caused the disease, so now there's no food at all. The food we managed to snatch before it was before it all it all began. But nothing to offer save for some bread and milk. I mean, anything. We're not ma we're not mad at wife. Don't worry about it, Laura. The train must have arrived soon. I wonder why it's late. Sometimes I fear these delays may have something to do with the quarantine. I hope so. I hope it had departed before the quarantine was announced. Let us all hope. Wow, so all that food and stuff we got was destroyed, apparently. Very busy day, killing muggers and combating dehydration. Yeah, yeah, it's been a it's a, been a heck of a day. So great, all that food and stuff apparently we bought the other day has been destroyed. Great, what a complete waste of a day. I'm not even sure what I should do next. If I should just go kill those two guys and figure out what that body is, or what? There's another sick guy. I'll we'll go talk to the cane since we're here. But I mean, I guess at least that proves that this learning module is sort of fair. That if you just happen to stumble across, like, the answer to one of your problems, you can 100% just get lucky and find the solution. It won't lie to you. If you find the solution, you find the solution. This way. It's speedrunnable. Yeah, exactly. If you can just figure out where the... If you know where the locations are, you might actually be able to speedrun some of this stuff. Money might be kind of hard, and, like, your ability to, um... Keep yourself fed might be difficult, but outside of that, technically I would say it's this is speed runnable, yeah. Because we died and restarted, so those buildings didn't move, so those are set locations. Like, we know that. It's just, it's just weird architecture. I thought maybe there might be something interesting in here, but no. Oh, wait. What is this? This could be interesting. Nope. It's just a sealed room. Like, I mean, we'll probably come back here for something at some point, but... At least we know it's there, I guess. I like the way his left hand is like open, like he's like in like a World War II era training video for combat. It's very interesting. I can just picture him like, gotcha, <laughs> like leans down and like combat mode activated. So we got to talk to Maria first, and then we can go talk to the other canes. Oh, you got rubber boots. Repellent, oh, $4,000. Ankle boots, short boots. The material is a good repellent, protecting the feet and ankles from contact with infected surface. Provides no protection against blows and rat bites. Oh, okay. So being attacked by rats is an issue we need to worry about. That's good to know. I was wondering about that. Uh, and then another one of these for four thousand dollars to get to get uh, virus boots. It's good to know. I have to keep that in mind. If we ever get really ahead on cash, I'm kind of curious on why there's no children out. I'm a little frustrated. I've been saving up all my tradables to get bullets and stuff. Oh, mother! Why can't you be here with us? So that's how it is. Clearly, Simon has not reached the end of his earthly path yet. Are you aware of Katarina's recent claims? No. What, did she decide to make herself heard again? Yes, she's made a prophecy that I won't take seriously, of course, but you might find it interesting. What was it? About the Dune ones, probably. Probably so, since she must have been seeing more or less the same thing I see, though from an entirely different angle. Katarina is older than me, but her visions are distorted by a prophet known as Morphine. <laughs> I like that line. It's distorted by a prophet known as Morphine. Too much noise. 
She spoke about a tangler that is some smothering itself and therefore requires a work of intervention involving blood. Uh, she spoke about a tangler. She proposed killing. That sounds convincing enough. Katarina has always found evil attractive. I see. Is that it? What is? Okay, please do stay in. I guess that was it. Okay. Maybe I should have mentioned the uh, other kid, the changeling with her instead. Oh, ladies enter. That was something else we came across. We finally met one of the other playable characters. We met the changeling and have been able to actually talk to her and stuff now. Not that she really said much. She kind of just went on a crazy rant and like gave a speech to us, but you know, what can you do? Oh wait, let's go talk to him first. Oh, whoop, whoop. Get a grip, get a grip. Continue gripping. Okay. Few people know death. We only endure it. There's a poor guy really? for a noble. Okay, he nothing new with him, so we go talk to the other Kane brother. Okay. Okay. That does it. I'm gonna break soon. Most curious, what is it? The Ladley Younger asked me to tell you the following. The terminate has been closed before the Padron was. There are many witnesses to that. Really, what is he getting at? There's just no reason to believe that the situation on the terminate is different from the inside the tower. No reason to believe that the situation on the terminate is different from the inside the tower. Ingenious. Darn it. All right. So, so be it. That's how he's spinning it. Then I'm forced to leave him alone for now. You can tell him that it will only last until we find proof that not everything in is in order inside the territory. There's no doubt in your mind that I'm obviously only doing all this to get the old monarchist real location of Simon's body to me. Uh, order your son to open the polyhedron so the monarchist agent can inspect it. That will give us the right to inspect the territory. I haven't been wasting my time either in the meantime. The information my curious have brought back is terrible. There's a ripper in the town. Fragments of human bodies have been found. It's either a stranger who doesn't observe our traditions or it really is something or something sent by the steep who is the stranger i don't believe in steep monsters who could need dead bodies who is the stranger earlier i feared that big vlad was settling him as the t in the ceremony it's clear now that he isn't the case he is on the loose i think if he is the thief also i believe that he he's the very man who's been accused of patricide the cursed wayward son of is lord barakla does he think it's him i made him up my mind yet i just had my suspicions the end times are upon us if if sons have ceased to honor their fathers, they are turning the earth towards the void, dropping, toppling what their parents built and what these wayward children are best at. They never create anything in its place. So you're talking about your own son. My son is now, now found in a kingdom of his own. There, there it is, towering above our sinful earth. He wouldn't let anyone into the into that world, not even his own father. If you're interested to know what's going on there, give it a try. Maria thinks you're a man from whom nothing is impossible. I too have long been invested in what's going on inside that place. Okay, so wait, what is our new mission? Uh, the body of the immortal. The young man be under his spectral son. Agreed with the idem. Demands at once. He does not want the tower to be implicated. This seems to be hiding something there, but whatever it is, it is clear not the disease. Moreover, I don't think I can. I'm the only one that's trying to deceive. Perhaps I could use this whole affair as an excuse to sneak into the mysterious tower across the river. I can speak to Vlad about whatever secrets I uncovered there. Off to the battle with the boy. I request that I find the little boy who ran off to the infected district. She wants me to take the Shriner from him. It's reasonable to assume that the child is to be found somewhere near the silent house. Okay, so we did get a quest for that, to go over there and find the kid. I did my playthrough of Kingdom Come Deliverance. It's part of the module many people hate that lasts a while. You have to be pretend to be a monk in a training to find a killer hiding among other monks in training. My playthrough I ended up skipping that by sneaking into the place at night and pickpocketing all the sleeping monks until I found the evidence of who it was. Wow, nice. I mean, that's a way to do it, though, right? Yeah, I think I've got that that on. Um, I've got that module saved on. I think Good Old Games has it on sale right now, so I might snag that one too. It sounds interesting, and you know, I apparently I as I can as you can see, I appreciate a good first person story. Even if they're really crazy and wacky, like this one. Okay. 
You all right, lady? No, thank you. Okay, so if I go over here and talk to Yolanda, or whatever her name is. Oh, you know what? Remember how old Vlad said that someone was stealing bodies? I bet that's what those two guys are doing. And he said it had to be more than one person. So it's got to be those two guys in that place are the ones that are stealing the bodies. And that's why they have that dead body. You'll think of something, of course, won't you? I'm taking risks. Oh, can I not give you the stuff then? Skilled in sneaking and stealing since I love playing that as a criminal. Ah, gotcha. Um, I guess I can't give her the bottle of tyrene or whatever. I guess it wasn't. What time is it? It's nine o'clock in the morning. Maybe what I do is I take a tyrene to get my health up and get my exhaustion down right now and I just take like a three hour nap. Oh, wait, wait, uh, drugs. Okay, so we got the tyrene, we've got some of this. We got the immunity booster. Take a couple of these. And then we take a tyrene. And then we take, hit this, and then we get like a three, uh, well, I'll do a four. 12, we'll do a four hour nap. I should get rid of all of our exhaustion and our health is going down and it's not up and we died in our sleep. Why did we die? What? Can you feel how rapid my heartbeat is? What? Apparently the tyrene is and not work does not work when you have <sighs> frustration. Okay, so the tyrene apparently does not work if you're infected. In fact, it just kills you instead, apparently. Great, 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 great. So we wasted all that money and effort on that for no reason. Okay, no, 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 no. Okay, I'm going back. The hiring doesn't heal when you sleep, I think? Oh, I thought that's what it specifically said it did. I'm going back, I don't care. I'm not gonna be able to recover from that. I don't remember it saying that, oh, okay. Okay, uh, where are we? Okay, I saved. Okay, I saved right outside of the house. Perfect. So all we got to do is go talk to the canes again. So what does Tyrene say it does? A strong infusion of uh, her boost immunity, acts as an anesthetic, stores strength during sleep. According to elder locals, critical doses of Tyrene can alter the effects of infection. Some of the effects of the Tyrene are still unknown. So yeah, it's supposed to increase my strength while I'm sleeping. Apparently it doesn't do that. Apparently what it does is just kill me and increase my infection. I feel frustrated. Just a wee. Yeah, it doesn't give any values like the other one. So I don't know. Maybe it's a total hit or miss thing. I don't know. Right, that's fine. Try this again. Uh, let's see. So we don't need this tyrene. I guess we can wait and do something with it. Maybe at some point we'll figure something out and tyrene will be like a request, like a quest item, like some of that food was, and we'll be ahead of the game. Otherwise, I don't know. Uh, I think we're going to take a couple of these. And we'll take two of those. Ugh, I need so much. Yeah, we'll just take one, I guess, for now. Oh, yeah, yeah, but we wanted to sell. Yeah, we got the lockpicks back again. So we can sell the lockpicks. Uh, 72. 360 for the ring. I think the rings are worth like five to the little girls, though. Is this coffee? No, oh, it's a walnut. Okay, that's fine. We can keep the walnut. How much does this sell for? 360? I think that's what we bought it for. Bullets sell high, but we, we need those right now because we're about to go get into a gunfight. So, yeah. So we'll take that. Okay. Okay, that's fine. It's fine. It's all fine. Everything's good and fine and fine and good. Okay. Come over here, talk to her, get this information, the new update about... Uh, 
about uh, the food stuff. Dark rings under your eyes. Right. That's all hope. Okay, so now we know that all the food was destroyed, and it didn't matter that we wasted all the time and effort buying all that food. It was all destroyed anyway. Let's go talk to the canes again real quick. Luckily, they're not far. I'm still annoyed that there's no sprint button, but that's fine. I haven't seen any drunk guys around for a little while now either. Hmm. I think my hunger is okay, right? Yeah, my hunger's about half. We're okay on the hunger. Vlad talked about those body snatchers. So those guys are probably body part of the... Oh, okay. It's like... I'm being attacked, but no, it looks like it's just... Sound... Song... Different song started up. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, that's the bed. What is... She claims she made a prophecy. I see. Okay. So she feels that she's being, her her vision is being obscured by the morphine she's addicted to, which makes some uh, sense. It would explain why she got so kind of worked up during her speech there. Go talk to this guy, that the other Kane brother talked to. Yes. Okay. Uh huh. It's reasonably the situation is very different from the inside. There's no doubt in my mind that I was doing all this in a real location time his body. Ripper in the town. Who is this stranger? Who could need dead bodies? Since the dawn of time, the beliefs of the people have forbidden them to just sect their dead. The people are prominent. The mysteries of the anatomy pernate the mysteries of creation. That is taboo. In this troubled time, the demon could have come to have broke it. Destruction of a body will put the earth in pain. How do we find this person? Earlier, I feared that Big Lad was settling with ceremony. I think it's him. Yes, I'll follow your advice. Okay. The wiki. Tiring boost immunity, but also exhaustion. That's it? Because that wasn't even the problem. Because our exhaustion was going down while we were sleeping. Huh. Then what was killing us? Is it because the infection's so high? Health drain was just from infection. Oh, okay. Well, well, but so tiring boost immunity, but also exhaustion. Wow, that is good to know. Well, I mean, at least we got the tyrene if we need it to boost our immunity. Oh, nice bottle and a pocket watch. Okay. Um. Okay, so Hell Drain is just from inf Oh, there's a drunk guy. We gotta go talk to him and get some bandages. Hi. Barger, please. Oh, you got two. Nice. How much do you want for this? You want five for both? This doesn't even do anything. I don't need both. I just need this. I can buy the tourniquets. Okay, what's my health actually at? Okay, that's fine. We can we can do that now. Um, let's do a couple of these to get our immunity back up. And then we'll take one of these, and that'll get our health back up. Okay. Oh, okay. Actually, we should also save. Uh, day three. Yeah, we'll save over this one. So, okay, if we go talk to him now, he should tell us where the body's at. 
And then on top of that, we got the killer to go deal, or those two body snatcher guys to go deal with. And we gotta go see if we can't find that little kid. He's gonna be somewhere near the silent house, which I assume means one of the houses next to it, since we couldn't go in the actual silent house. Don't forget, kids, always check random doors to see if they're unlocked. You might find something interesting inside. That's a that's a that's a direct note from me me to the world, and please, kids, don't actually ever do that. Okay, so I guess I should I'm gonna take one of these anti-infection pills. Okay, we're take both of those, and our health went down from that too, though. Holy cow! Oh my god. Okay. Is the disease really contagious? <sighs> to settle the matter, Victor will no longer insist on inspecting the terminal. It occurred to me that a map with the infected areas ch charted out would significantly help carriers and medical aids. I need to you, but I've always seen that. Men are now assigned to the produ produce such maps daily. The cost of making one's copy is a mere, let's say, thousands or so. I'm sure, to order copy when I have required some. Okay. Oh, so it's a new map that's updated. That's good. Did you hear that? Did it come from inside the well? Or am I getting the jitters? No, I heard some of that too. Man, just out of the matter with Victor. Keep my word, honoring the vulnerable Simon's remains is our mural goal. We are bound by the same grief. That's a, there's a ripper, perhaps even more than one. On the loose of the knots. I think they're they're runaway butchers. Butchers. Why would they decide to find bodies? Well, let's just say they use the innards for fortune telling. Times are difficult. I think their desire to tell which what fortune the fortune may have in the story for them is perfectly understandable. I mean, to be honest, I'm not sure myself. One curious young man managed to trace their path. It seems they have been carrying the dead to the spleen district. I mark the house on your map. If I if they resist, am I allowed to kill them? Not like kill, but take whatever possessions of theirs they may find in their house. Body snatchers are no longer protected by law, even if they happen to be the butchers. Very well. Oh yeah, see we just happened to come across this place completely by accident earlier. It's all very suspicious. And my exhaustion is way high. Okay, so what we're going to have to do... Okay, cool. Interesting on the wiki. Apparently, patrolmen can... Can have food for sale. Interesting. That's good to know, actually. Yeah. Okay, so... My exhaustion's really high because I took those pills. Oh, there's another drunk guy we can get a bandage from. Don't look at me, I'm just going through the trash. Shut up. And yeah, maybe once they start to like me more. Okay, cool, you've got one, two, three, four, five. Which one of these, are you sure? Yes, thank you. Got another bottle, perfect. Okay. Okay, so we need a bed. I don't want to say that's so zoomed in. Well, town hall. Hmm. We could probably hit the shelter and sleep in the shelter. Yeah, we can hit the shelter and sleep in the shelter. And hope to God we do not die in our sleep. I lowered the virus. So that should be good, right? You have no food or anything. Okay. I cannot believe she didn't actually want that tiring. I spent so much money on it. Luckily, it's still early in the day. So we should be okay. And at this rate, a full, like, five hours should get rid of all of our exhaustion. And then hopefully what we can do is we'll use the, um sleeping meds to get her health up and then use a bandage to hope it stays that way hopefully I'm very curious on exactly how the bandages work or the uh, healing the potion healing oh nice but all the kids are gone all the kids are gone So, 
I don't have any more immunity boosters. Don't won't actually kill you despite what the kids say. It just lowers your HP to five. It's above that value. And the bandage is just a flat heal. Okay. Yeah, I figured that's how it worked with the sure motors, because it sounded like um adults would survive it they would just be weak from it so that makes some amount of sense does it actually cure the infection or does it just lower it okay and i've still got three of these so we're good on that take that it cures it okay well cool so we've got two cures for it then if we happen to find enough bandages which no one sells by the way only place i can get bandages is apparently off drunk people which is super obnoxious So, yeah, bottle. Yeah, bottle, okay. So as of right now, how low is our infection? It should be pretty low. Yeah, infection's pretty low, exhaustion's high, hunger's at medium, immunity is at 50, and health is low. Okay, yeah, so we gotta go to yeah, we'll go over here and sp stay the night at the shelter. Stay the night at the shelter. Or not the night, but take a nap at the shelter. Try to get our health and our stamina back. And I guess we can come over here and try to see if the kid's in one of these four buildings. Because I think the one we went into last time was this one and the kid wasn't in there. So it's got to be probably one of these four. We got to be super careful. Ugh, it's going to be rough. Okay. further down and we still got the two body snatchers we got to deal with yep, can't go in there this is just a food place I think we bought all the food from earlier today so that's oh is that a kid what that's the first kid we've seen all day do kids not come out until what after nine maybe oh yeah there's another one Yo, kid, what's up? What's with the open mouth, kid? You're drawing flies. What? We got. Oh, you've got bullets. Okay. What are these worth? One, one, two, one. Uh, and those aren't even bullets I have anything to do with yet, I guess. Hmm. Uh, these are worth two, right? Two. And two, yeah. Uh, let's do it this way. Oh, wait a minute. Like that. Uh, let's take one of each. Okay, thanks, kid. Okay, so yeah, kids apparently don't come out till nine in the morning. Just good to know, I suppose. Your pocket pumpkin. Why not? Sure. Ah, oh, I can buy that stuff, kid. I don't need that. What about you, kid? Let's well, barter, lad. I have a lot of curious things. Uh, nope. Painkiller. Got that. Oh, a kid and a drunk. Perfect. Okay, with the kid and the drunk's coming this way. Hey, it's the manly kids. Uh, what is that? Oh, it's rifle ammo. I'm not that worried about that. I don't even have a rifle yet. Where's that drunk guy? Okay, I thought maybe he disappeared on me. I'm gonna be very upset. Uh, yes, perfect. One, two, three, four, five. Trade. Bandage. Yes, great. In the infected district, you should check to see if the patrolmen do actually have food. I mean, I talked to that other guy the last time, but he didn't want to barter with me, I didn't think. So, we'll check again when we get over there. Check the medical building. I think we've been to this one, but just in case. Oh yeah, this is where we sold the lock picks. Okay. Okay. Now the trash bins seem to be a little bit more randomized or like resetting. So double check those again. But all right, yeah, we'll go over here. 
the infection's low, so it shouldn't kill us, I hope. And then we'll take a nice nap, get our exhaustion back down. Six hours should be okay. That'll take us up to, what, about five o'clock? Or no, six would be nine to five. That would be... Okay, okay, so... Okay, well, let's save it first. Yeah, let's overwrite this one. Okay, save it. And then drugs. So we want to do... So we want to do, what is this? Let me see, good for restoring strength. During excruciating pain, the effect lasts for five hours. Yeah, so we could do five hours of this. We pop this. Oh, that maxed out our exhaustion though. Ugh. Okay, we do this and then we get five hours of sleep. Hunger's going up. Okay, five hours is enough. With the, you know, the description is short for exhaustion. E. Oh, okay. Good. Good to know. Okay, now we need food. Okay, that's fine. This is definitely a weird balancing act. Okay, but health is okay now. Hit with two bandages. Exhaustion's low. Immunity's good. Okay. We've got bandages, right? Yeah. Yeah, hopefully the patrolmen have food. Okay, perfect. That takes that up. Okay. What do you got, kid? Nothing. Okay. Oh, is that another drunk guy? That should be a separate, different drunk guy. Okay, and then there's... Oh, uh, yeah, there's one more place up there for food. Perfect. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Starting to get a little low on bottles, but luckily they come back pretty quick. Okay. So we got that. I guess the other question is, do we want to go deal with... Do we want to deal with these guys right now? Maybe we should deal with them before we go. Because, I mean, that's a side quest, and it would be nice to help the kid out, but we need to get this done. Uh, save. Um, let's just do a new save. We need this. Weapons. We're going to take our blat blat out. Make sure it's nice and loaded up. Oh, nice. It rang in some of the cash. Nothing. 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 No food or anything. Nothing in the bucket. Yeah, the music is really interesting. Cash. Ooh. Immunity boosters. Nothing, okay. Nothing. Okay. I can't loot them either. That's weird. I can, apparently, yeah, I can't loot them. And I cannot interact with the dead body either. But they're dead, so. It would have been nice if there was some food here or something. That takes care of that. Okay, and then... Yeah, was this... Oh, that was close. What was your favorite part of Dead State? Um, my favorite part of Dead... The... A lot of the writing was really good. Um... 
The writing was really good. The combat stuff was fine. Fortunately, it wasn't super balanced, but it was fine. Um, the maps and stuff, like the overall world map for the whole state was actually pretty good stuff. Generally speaking. Oh, wait, I should save. You don't have food, Richa. I think we'll be fine. Okay, no. Um, yeah, I would say the writing for a lot of it was probably the best part, generally. Um, the, the base combat was fine. Whoa, hey there. Oh, is that a food shop? Oh, tell me you've got something in here for the love of God. Please tell me you've got something in here to eat. What? Is this? Oh, maybe this isn't the right door. Sometimes the doors are weird. Oh, yeah, it's this one. Oh, you do. Awesome. How much cash do I have? 40 and 827 for 825 for bread? Really? Ugh. All right. Uh, but yeah, we'll take both of these and the crackers. Yeah. Okay, cool. Look at that. And then we got rations. Okay, that'll get our hunger down a bit. Um, yeah, I mean, I think overall, I think overall I enjoyed Dead State, generally speaking. I think my biggest issue with it was just 100% really, 52% really. My biggest issue with it, I think, was just how buggy it was. It A lot of the bugginess really, really, really hurt the fun of it. Oh, here we go. Want to barter? Oh, they do have food. What is this? Fried meat. This meat was cooked three weeks ago. Okay. So that, that's fine. And you'll take razor, wrist razors for a dollar and tiring for two. And he wants, what, five for this? Okay. So give him two of these. Oh, and five. Perfect. Yes. Uh, are you sure? Yep. Got it. Great. Okay. Okay, cool. So that's even better. Wait, did it not go through? What? Oh, I guess it didn't go through. Okay. One of these and then one of those and then we're even. Perfect. There we go. Okay. Rations and we eat some food. Great. Okay. So this house isn't infected. Okay. So it can't be this house. That house isn't infected. So it could be this next one. Oh, and I don't have any. I don't have any. Oh my God, it's still coming. You gotta be kidding me. Well, nothing I could do about that. God, that's obnoxious. Okay. I'm gonna try to find this stupid kid. I don't really like the concept that this stuff is like aimed. Or seems to come for you. Like it will change direction to come and get you. That seems I don't I don't appreciate that. That seems unfair. I mean, generally speaking. Are you kidding me? Is it coming downstairs again right now? How is that possible? So how do I get by it? And it came and got me. What? Okay, this might actually just be impossible. This is just flat out going to kill me, I think. I did not expect to have this much trouble with with this. I didn't expect the virus to, like, hunt me through the air like this. I thought I would just have to kind of dodge it when it pop up.
No, okay. Was this the same building? I thought this was a different building. This apparently appears just to be the woman. Yeah. Also, the movement in here is very messed up because of all the stuff on the floor. Yeah, whatever. I guess I'm just gonna have to freaking take this and die, okay? I kind of enjoyed this stuff that there wasn't at. The tenth at a hardcore RPG in a zombie sink since I really hadn't seen that. Uh, also, enjoyed the base building mechanics. Biggest issue was that the whole module was just too incomplete in a lot of ways, but especially because of the bugs. Yeah, it just... Oh, it's one of these guys. Yeah, unfortunately, this just... The bugs really, really, really hurt it. Which is sad to say, but... Okay, yeah, there's no back door on this building. That building's not infected, so... And this is the main building, right? Yeah, that's the actual building building. Some needles. Well, that implies maybe the kids are here. No. Other stuff gonna help me too much, but another door. I don't see the kid in here. Why is all this stuff like in weird spots? Uh injured woman. woman. Not much I can really do for you. Bring one of these protective gowns, which don't seem to be doing a bunch. Uh, not seeing the kid anywhere. Yeah, I think with the exception of the bugs... I think if they had if they had had the time or the experience or whatever they needed to fix the bugs, I think generally speaking they would have it would have definitely been a lot overall more fun, 100% more fun. Um, okay, so that was that one. So there should be one more over here. Oh, great. Cause this is the main door. Crazy. I think they should have just had the. Let's be stationary and pop in and out. Yeah, that would have definitely been a lot better was the stationary clouds. Like 100% stationary clouds would have made so much more sense than hunting you down like that. Unless it's, it's less it's specific just to do the implication of like this is a malevolent force that someone has sent out. So this is it, right? Like... This is, yeah, I know, I'm infected more, I get it. Okay, this is very similar to the last building we were in. Uh, no kids, right? I don't know. This this feels a little. Yeah, it's just these same two girls. Yep, same two women. Okay. This is the other side of the building or something. Where are the stairs? Yeah. I, uh, this this is not. This seems messed up to me. Like this is not well done. Okay. Infected some more. Not much I can do about it, unfortunately. Like, lots of bullets in here, which I guess is nice, but. Okay. 
Yep. Like, nothing I can do about this. Oh, I actually was able to duck that one. Okay, well, he's not here, so... Yeah, I'm gonna have to pop a Schroeder after this, and then... Luckily, we did that fight first. Okay, so which side of the house are we on? Okay, we're on the same side of the house. So we go straight ahead. This one's also next to it. I mean, can't we just like yell for the kid? Do we really need to go all the way into these areas? I mean, there's just nothing I can do. Like, I'm assuming that's sort of the point, but like... It just makes it even more unfair to have them hunt you. Oh, lemons. Well, lemons make us hungry, but they will boost our immunity. stairs. Yeah, I might save scum this one and just like find out which building the kid's in and then load back because we saved real recently. Because this is uh, not fun. Like this room is just big enough I can kind of like run around it. Yeah, I don't see the kid in here either. At least it fills these places with lots of items. Sometimes, yeah. So the kid wasn't in here. Oh, I need the door. Okay. So where is he? We've done all the buildings now that are like anywhere near the... Uh, maybe this one? The props are stationary and can't shove them out of the way. Yeah. This is... This is probably so far my the least interesting or fun to play through thing. And this is... Mm, okay. Yeah, this stuff littering the floor, blocking your path, that's not cool. Yeah, I guess the kid's not in here either, which is frustrating, and I'm stuck. Oh, 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 almost stuck, but not quite stuck. Um, let's see, I might be able to pull it off right here. Oh, it went away. Oh, it's coming back already, though. Nope, it got me, dead. Oh, you're not dead? Or am I dead? 
Oh, there's another floor. Oh, just a woman. Well, it's maxed out, so I'm definitely going to die here any second. I mean, this is absurd that I'm having to, like... I feel like I'm in a horror movie and being chased by a serial killer or something. Okay, I don't know where this kid's at then, because they said he'd be by this this the silent house, which is this one. And now we've checked every building adjacent other than this one because we can't get into it. That it could be? Like, is it maybe it's this? These double buildings? Uh yeah, because we did this one, right? Yeah, we did that one already. Max out, it doesn't immediately. Kill. I guess not. Or it could be at like 99 of 100. Oh. oh. Awkward running into you here. Oh. Oh, come on! I got around it. Whatever. Well, we're going to burn through all of our resources trying to recover from this. Just a sick girl. Weird that it's only sick girls inside of this place, but. Yeah, I could cheese it. You're not wrong. Yeah, my health is dropping rapidly. Um, I don't have any kind of anti drops on me, right? No. I have the shroomers, I guess. I could take that. I'm going to hang off on it, though. Okay. Oh, we came out the back of the house. Oh, uh, yeah. So this other house. Oh. No, not dead yet. Okay, cool. Uh, rations. What does this do? It increases hunger. Yeah. My, I guess my other problem is, is with this, it's like, hey, he's in one of these locations. It's like, okay, so we've now checked all these locations, and guess what? He does not, there's another injured girl. He does not actually appear to be in any of the locations we were told he should be in. Which means I'm just wild goose chasing this for no reason. Which is very frustrating. I guess you could argue like, you know, nope, I got me. I thought I got a right from that, but I guess not. Yeah, we've been in all the buildings that are anywhere adjacent to that now. And I can't go upstairs anymore, so let me just leave. And then I guess what we can do. Yeah, that's it. I don't know what else it could be. Unless he's at, like, Sticky's house, and they just mean in this district. Uh, and the quest notes. Um, quest that I find the little boy who ran off to the infected district. She wants me to take the from him. It's reasonable to assume that the child is to be found somewhere near, somewhere close to the silent house. Yeah, it's got to be over at Sticky's house. We, I mean, we can recover from this if it's assuming it doesn't actually kill us, kill us here in a second. It's just not going to be easy or fun. Uh, okay, I'll be around the corner. Oh, is this him? Loafer? Oh, that's me. What do you know? What are you doing here? Victoria told me. 
look, could you tell me where I didn't go anywhere and just randomly bumped into me here? Uh, or better still, not over here by the river? And give me the Schroeder. I've been told that it's the place where this is, you know, all, this sort of tongue comes out of the ground. Tongue made of dirty lamps, like made of thick air. You're standing at the exact spot, sir. I've been told, I've been told that this is the place where this, you know, some sort of tongue comes out of the ground and a tongue made of dirty lamp lumps, like made of thick air. You're standing on this X box, sir. Pot. Give me the box. I'll test it myself. Oh, actually, you might, you seem to be right. I do have a fever. Let me take the summer, will you? Cut it. Good kinds tell lies. Give me the thing and get out of here. Run back to your crowd and tell them that I banned the, the test and some others are deadly rather than curative. I've, I'll testify that you stood your ground until the very end. All right, I suppose I'll have no position to argue. We would confirm what really happened here, right? If anyone asked. You're poisoning yourself. You know what? Do what you please. Yes. Okay, so we've found it, apparently. We found him. He wasn't actually in one of these houses for whatever godforsaken reason. He was just standing around outside of it. Like a dingus. Like an absolute dingus. This is Sticky's house. It's in the affected district, but it appears to not be infected itself. Thank God. Okay, so if we do this, now let's check this out. Drugs. So here's what we're going to find out what happens. We're going to find out what happens. Okay, it did get rid of the... It, we did make us immune. It took us down to five. We're actually okay, team. Well knows the kitten whose meat it has eaten. I don't talk how important the matter. Okay. Okay, so the sticky's fine. Okay. Okay, so we're... Kind of getting this figured out. Our health is going back up. I want to barter. We got shot, a shotgun shell and a bunch of food. Properly cooked. I do not know how to properly cook it. Okay, okay, okay. So we're, we're okay. We're okay. We've stabilized, I think. Our health is low. Our immunity is low. Our hunger's in the middle and exhaustion's in the middle. That's okay. Our infection's gone. Um, we have some lemons. Um, they should be a highly viable fruit. Provides a rich supply of vitamins and reduces fatigue, but increases hunger. Okay, so this reduces fatigue. Get some immunity first. Oh, oh, you mean the... Oh, I got what you're saying. Yes, that makes sense. I guess that would have been more optimal. I get what you're saying. Because the immunity boosters lower our health. So if we would have used those first, it doesn't matter if we're going from, you know, 70 to 0 or 70 to 5 or... Um... 20 to 5, right? I get what you're saying. This guy's still open in the middle of this? Really? All right. What are these? 35 for that? Uh, well, since we don't have many kids to deal with right now, unfortunately. Okay. Ooh, I do not like those noises. Oh, no, 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 no. You stay over there, Death Cloud. Oh, here's a medical place. It's a mini boost to reduce your HP and the shunner actually don't lower your HP. If your HP is already low. Right, right, yeah. Okay, we don't have any cash on us, which is fine. Okay, so we gotta go back to the canes. Yeah, right, deal with them. Wait, who do I need to actually talk to now that I think about it for turning this quest in? Once. I have another choice but to test the shoulder myself. All I can hope the runaway butchers are hiding the body they stole in the house pinpointed by Vlad. The body has been found. Is it Simon? Oh, it, wait. Do I need to check the body? Because I tried and it wouldn't let me. Yeah, don't want to get exposed again, that's for sure. 
Because we can come back from this. It won't be easy, but it is doable. What time is it? It's... What is that? 10? No. It's 8, right? 8? Well, I guess we did spend a lot of time running around doing stupid stuff. Okay. Hey, little kid. What do you got? Anything? Uh, bullets. You want one for the bullets, right? Yeah, we'll do that. And the bullet's worth, what, 200 bucks for us? Oh, and a drunk guy. Perfect. We've got a couple bandages. We just don't have enough. Yes. Oh, he doesn't have any bandages! You useless, useless, useless drunk. Okay, so let's check this again. Since apparently we do need to identify the body. Oh, okay, no, it was not. Okay, we just gotta finish up the letting them know thing. Okay. So the body's gone, and the two dead, the two body snatchers are also gone. So yeah, we just gotta progress the story now. Which I think means we need to talk to the canes. We can talk to this guy on the way out. Or where is... Oh, he's back over there. Yeah, we can... Wait. Oh, we gotta go to this. Oh, yeah, we can sneak in there. So we gotta go talk to the canes. That, that may have... Okay, and then we can go into there. Uh, and that's just her. Okay, that doesn't do us any good. So we gotta head south. So it lowers exhaustion and increases hunger to eat lemons. That's a really interesting choice. Be on the lookout for drunks and kids to trade stuff with. That's a woman. Doesn't do us any good. There's a kid. Oh, and a drunk. What do you got? Uh, we'll take the pistol bullet. Except, a drunk. Please have yes. Five. Yeah, kids and drunks are best friends. It's insane to me that. Oh, nice. The only place we can get bandages, though, in this whole town, is from drunk people, and you can't just buy them. Which is insane. Oops. I have. Predators. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Sweet. Um, that's worth five. One, two. Okay, I have this and one of these, and we'll take this. Trade. So we gotta go turn this in at the canes, and then we gotta go less. Yeah, we gotta go talk to the canes, and then hopefully them, and that's all we had to do. And not get into a single fight, or we are donezo. If we even get looked at funny, we are going to die. There's a kid I can trade with. Your pockets? Why not? Sure. Mm, booster meds. How much do I have? I think I have a lot of booster meds. I'm not worried about that right now. Unfortunately, I can't really afford to sleep right now. Drunks. 
don't think we run into as many drunks over in the fancy part of town. It definitely seems to be the other parts that we run into them the most. Hmm. Well, I mean, I guess if we ever decide to play through this again with one of the other um, characters, we'll know that, at least on that quest, that the kid's not inside of a building, he's actually outside of the building, which is great. A uh, bullet. Yeah, I have one of these. I'll trade it for a bullet. Work? I think it worked. I guess I shouldn't be surprised that they sort of bamboozled me on that one. Thanks, though, kid. It's like something. Oh, I guess I don't need to talk to you about this. Okay, well, who do I need to talk to about this then? Okay, I'll hit the terminology or the uh, polyhedral, and then I guess I'll have to go see if I can't find the young Vic. Maybe that's who I got to turn this into. Wait, did it actually tell us that the other thing is done? The testament myself. Okay, well, we've tried that. It didn't prompt us on anything. Then we've got this insane thing. Oh, I do not have time for this. God, this is so absurd. We might not have enough time. We might actually have to load back and abandon going into the houses. That took longer than I thought it did, and it didn't help us at all. I'm going to try to play this out, but if we die, if we run out of time and the quest fails and we lose, then we will load back and we will skip going into those houses and just go talk to the kid and move on. Because, I mean, it was nice that we were stuff in there, but it wasn't like there's was anything. Like, it's not like we found shotgun in there or something or a full weapon upgrade. Wow, this is completely absurd. Only, unless, or else the tower will topple. I'm a friend of the Canes. I'm, I've come to see Khan. What the f facets to mourn his grandfather. Come in. Go ahead and go inside. You really don't want us to all to perish, do you? I really don't. Oh. oh. Wow. Wow. Okay. It will be as I say. Ults are not allowed in here. It can topple the tower. This is super weird. Common sense just otherwise. I don't want to be staying for long. What I have the pleasure of talking to. My name is Casper. I'm son to Victor and Nina. The us the con c canes. Uh, your name? Are you a friend of our family? I am. I am. Only children can live in the tower. It's off limits to the rest. I'm the one who's listening, boy. Tell me about this structure. What are those three-legged things? I don't. I, I'll, I'll, we'll figure it out. Yes, I thought so. We children do not see them. There, on the left, is the coast of New Sea. Behind you are the left cl cleft islands. Behind my left shoulder, not of the five path footpaths. The fact faucet I, a little way to the left from its from it is actually collapsed fridge from the legend of Ever Reborn. It's a poetic allegory. You're all dreamers in here. What are the walls you see made of, guests? Hmm, looks like paper. They have thick cardboard? Looks like paper? Strange. Very strange. The average thick-headed grown-up sees mirrored faces. Mirrored surfaces. 
It's the reason they're calling the Spectral Tower. Each person only sees an infinite series of their own reflection. That's That was the design. Are there really a thousand children in here? Yes, but they're all on the other side of the, f the facts. You can't see them, but they can see you clearly. The facts are a liable barrier. It's what? You, your doppelgangers, everyone who comes from across the river. Maybe doppelgangers. You do, two of them. Oh, a little meta statement there. Also enduring to save humanity. At least that's what they say. Every word they utter mirrors yours. So far, they've caused nothing but harm. What kind of harm? Our salvation lies in repose and silence. Our town must stay still now. Freeze, like someone who stirred up a nest of venomous snakes. The disease will abate and burn up in its own flames. I was told there, the, these were your words, were they? Close enough, but what do you mean <clears throat> double gangers have to do with anything? They make people uneasy. It's because of them that no one stays put. He's really liking this conversation, by the way. Disturbed by the... Wait, wait, wait. It's because of them no one stays put. Disturbed by the Harsbuck's actions and the Changeling's Barney preaching. People start fussing and end up lying their, laying their lives upon the altar of the common good. We children will not listen to you. Not a good idea. Why? What did I do to lose the trust of the children? I'm protecting our world. We... We were doing just fine without you. We can handle the plague even if the spell's the end of the world. Do you want to check out this place clean? Have a look around. It's, it is clean, I promise you. But I won't let you in, wise bachelor, no offense. You sure? You may mean well, but you're bringing evil and destruction all the same. The town is too fragile for your throating steps. Your every hand will crush us all, even if you were only grabbing us in order to pull us out of the abyss. Go in peace, everything is all right here. Become sick? I promise. I'll be able to talk to you any time here at the Agate Pit. And if something terrible happens inside, I'll be the first to shout for your help. I'll mention that. I'll mention what you said to Victor next time I talk to him. Three legged things? Oh, are you talking about these? Um, I think they're meant to be kind of weird bound up curtains or something. I don't know. Anything else to say? Nothing is interesting to me anymore. Okay, so I guess I talked to you to get out of here. Yeah, they're like curtains with legs, kind of. I mean, I'm, I'm chalking it up to this place. Okay, well, how do I leave? Uh, hello? I guess, do I not talk to you to get out of here? Children can live in the uh, I would really like to leave now. Oh, there we go. Oh. Oh, it's just magic. Okay, got it. Okay, maybe we can go talk to... Oh, wait. Let's check the quest. Child speaks like a grown man. His manners leave... Impression could it be that it only is right if the territory is protected from an external influence as diligently as the tower is I include both of the building for my inquiry from for now I have no quest for today Will The kids and adults see different walls. Yeah, well he claims that's what they see. I mean who knows what's really going on I mean he claims that Adults should see mirrors and an infinite projection of themselves, whereas the kids see no walls at all. We seem to see paper, which is interesting. Or thick cardboard, I guess, is the other option we could have gone with, but interesting choices. All right, so I guess we got to go talk to... I don't know. I guess we can hit the canes on the way back, but otherwise, the only person I can go think of to talk to is young Vic or the young uh, Vlad kid. Oh, it's got to be different for the other two, a hundred percent. I'm sure if I walked in was as the butcher guy or the hospice guy or whatever his name is, I'm sure it's going to be a hundred percent different than if I walk in with um, this character or the changeling. Basically guaranteed. Um. You have anything to say now? Vlad is right. Nope. Whatever okay. happens in the Okay. 
So I don't know what to do. I don't know who I need to talk to next for sure. And it's laid out now. We have really risk, run a risk of being mugged. Paper because Bachelor is a scientist. It'll be blood or flesh for the hospice and maybe something like stars for the changeling. Yeah, that that's a I, that's a solid guess, I would say. Basically, kind of the same thought process I was having, at least for why I was seeing paper. is like scientific notes and stuff, because it looked like it was all math and stuff like that. Okay, so it's still here. Um, but yeah, I don't know. It could be like bones and stuff. That's, that's for sure for the uh, hospice guy. Okay, I think he's over here, right? Yeah, he's this way. We'll grab these trash cans, but we still we we want to make sure we keep a lot of bottles with water on us just for the drunk guys. We need those bandages. Those things are super useful. Okay. If this isn't who we need to talk to, I'm not sure who else we need to talk to about this. Because it talked about, like, identifying the body, but it wouldn't let us do it. And then when we went back, the body was gone. So I'm assuming someone picked it up. Unless it was the, like, governor guy who's got temporary power. Interest speaks all sorts of tongues. No, nope, he doesn't care either. Okay. Hmm. Maybe I'm running around in circles now? Sister too, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. I guess I could talk to her. I didn't think about that. Yeah, just keep going straight. I guess I could talk to her and see if I can just finish that quest up. Oh, the music just changed. Is there like a mugger running in? The music just changes so abruptly. Or ends like it is now. Lump should be over here, right? Yeah, basically just straight down this road. Yeah, I don't like that the music has stopped. Oh, there it goes. It's starting to pick up a little bit more now. Just a little ambience in the background. Okay, we'll talk to the little sister and see if we need to turn that ke kid quest in. Yeah, it, it went super fast while I was inside those houses. That nap I took really set set things back. I feel a current. Oh, here we go. Veins. Oh, the termitory. Okay, I found the boy. Is everything all right with him? He's not sick, is he? No, he's he was lucky. I find the, I found I'll find the caches as soon as possible and retrieve the poison. Have any other places? He was lucky. Thank you. Can you test on, on on yourself, or am I mistaken? I already have. Apparently, I got the one I got was efficient. Next time we'll not be so lucky. Next time you will not be so lucky. We'll see. Okay, interesting. Do you know? Sending the orders of our new governor. What a disgrace. Using your name as an excuse, Sarov has ordered my father to organize an isolation ward, a hospital, and something else at his own expense. But my father treats you well. Is that a joke? Thing goes wrong. Do tell me. My father is a truly miserable man. Can you imagine how heavy the burden of his responsibility is? He's in charge of the lives of several thousand people. I'm also responsible. I'm also responsible for the lives of several thousand people right now. Let us hope that your father will support me out of mutual respect, if nothing else. Training me with your, this one, sorry. Of course he will. He must know already that our family used to be very rich. I happen to ha find out that almost all of our resources went to the capital to bribe the officials and attain drugs. You know, do not be too harsh on him. Transfer the money to the capital. Quite the contrary. I respect his actions and his choices. And I appreciate that it that you love your father so much. Cannot possibly guess. Curious, but I can. How did he did it beforehand? 
Ah, okay, yes. It's hard for us to believe in things. Like People like your father are the last to get exposed to danger. It's the poor guy first. Not until the specialized medicine arrives. Several thousand of the people live there. They cannot be allowed to get infected. The fact that there's no sick people inside? Is it a known fact? It is known for a fact that no one gets gets sick in the polyhedron. Not a single person has left it since the very beginning of epidemic. Now the children are noti notifying their parents that they are all in good health. Since else are begging the children to stay inside. You know, it's just weird to me that that's the same with the tariff for hmm. I, re I really hope so. Father knows what he's doing. All right. Anything else? Okay. So, did we finish that up? Whoops. No, put that away, idiot. Um, you're a man. Oh, we did. Hunters are extremely determ determinable to one's health, but they also eradicate the infection. Is this a mere coincidence, or did the children comprehend a cure? We will never find out. Okay. Um, okay, so wait. Son. Okay, wait. I suppose there's some of his body with some really cons, but maybe that would, maybe Victor would have some insight. Ruben took the body and uh, the ripper had anything to do with it. Whether the son of Victor agreed to withdraw the demands at once. I'm going man and really Okay, so yeah, it's not really telling me. It's not giving me any indication of who I need to talk to to turn in this body thing. Unless maybe it was the older Kane while I was there? This girl is dangerous. Okay, nothing. What time is it? Okay, it's 10 o'clock. We got two hours left. I don't know where I need to go, though. Um, close. I guess I could... Hmm. Yeah, it's got to be older Kane, I guess, because these guys weren't even interested in really in the investigation or anything much. I mean, uh, Big Vlad and, and them do the stuff at the cemetery, but that didn't help me out. Brad Griff... Ruben's Prosarium. Okay. Yeah, it's got to be the older Kane, I guess. Well, I'm really out of places to go otherwise. God, I hope I have enough time. I really don't know who to choose here. Yeah, I might have to reload. I don't know. Yeah, I, that's my that's only the thing I can think of because we talked to him about the missing body right away first thing in the morning When we talked to the younger Kane, he didn't really say too much until we talked to the older Kane. So maybe the older Excellent. Yep. We had a hard crash there twitch uh, twitch was not happy with us I'm not sure what happened exactly, but you know, what can you do twitch? It's twitch All right. Yeah, I didn't move forward. I just kind of locked froze things there for a second Okay, let's get let's get back to it. We're gonna go talk to the older Kane and see if this works. This is our kind of our last shot, though. If this if this doesn't work, then the day is a failure, and we're gonna have to like do some save scumming to buy us some time. Cause uh, yeah, I don't know who else to go talk to. We're gonna have to like like we've soft locked ourselves basically. We there's no way for us to progress progress without um. Oh, wow. I didn't realize it was almost 7 o'clock. Um, but, yeah, there's no way we're going to be able to progress without doing some save scumming here. There's just... It's not going to work. Hopefully, this is it, though. This is our one shot at not save scumming to get this done. Is it the older cane? Because if it's not the older cane, I don't know who else it could be. Oh, mugger. I have no health. If he, if he hits me at all, I'm just dead. So... Uh, normally... Intern man would jump into in and start fighting these people, but unfortunately, intern man had to take medication to stop a deadly, deadly virus from killing him, leaving him severely wounded. Um, he sacrificed his liver to save his heart, basically. All right, let's talk to him and see. I have a heartache. 
Okay, here we go. Yes. A body just uh, disfigured. However, I found it hard to believe this once belonged to your brother. I'll show you the building where I found it. I will send people there at once. You have my gratitude. Be cautious. Don't bring the body directly to the crucible. And don't forget to quarantine your people before they return to their everyday, everyday duties. Okay. Wow, four thousand dollar dues. Whoa! And we got the ending. We saved it. We saved it right at the end. We did it, team. We did it. It's a bitter errand to be the bearer of bad news. Although the body has been discovered, it has been mutilated beyond all recognition. Or you would be thankful for any news at all, however dire it may be. Yet something does not feel right. Okay. We did it. We did it, team. We did it. We we were right. We got it. We got it figured out. Big bucks. We got the four thousand uh, dollars. We got the we got the thing done. Now, now all we have to do is make it. Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Save. I'm gonna save. I'm gonna save. Um. Okay, so this is before we went into the house. The houses. Right, because we slept and it almost killed us. Okay, okay, yes, yes. We'll just keep going. We'll just keep going. <laughs> yeah, gonna be getting a Lambo. <laughs> Why is that the great doctor over there? I believe I hear his uh, horse. Oh, do you mean he's got the new Porsche 911? <laughs> like, what? Ah, yes, there's there he is now, coming up the road. Going, I would say, probably a full, oh, I don't know, 95 miles an hour on that dirt road? It's quite impressive how many horsepower those new uh, horses have, a.k.a. Uh, the Porsche. Or Ferraris. Is it Ferraris that have the horse? It's the Ferraris, right? Okay, we don't want to go crazy, crazy with buying stuff. Um, stops bleeding and immobilizes damaged tissue. I'm able to destroy the disease with it. Slightly harmful to health. Yes, okay. Hmm. We're not going to worry about it just yet. Okay, we just got to get out of here. We got to get into the house. Got to check on our... our um, what's her name? Uh, what would you call her? Like, our landlord slash, like, I don't know, friend with benefits? I don't know what to call this lady. Okay, okay. Okay, you got anything to say? Think of something, of course. Risk. Okay, cool. All right, all right. So we, we got it. We're here. We made it, team. We made it. Okay, so we save, we overwrite this. Okay, so what we need to do, okay, we don't have any food, but we can deal with that in the morning. So we need to do drugs. We need we to do lots of drugs. We differ more widely from ourselves than we do from others. We're gonna be super hungry when we wake up in the morning though, so we're gonna have to go get food right away. Boost immunity. Okay, so we just need to take one of these. My bedroom heal. is warmer than this place. Thanks for the offer. Um, but yeah, so what we'll do is we'll take this, Don't get up in the morning, my colors have faded. and then do the bandage to hopefully secure that health improvement. Take this. Take this. Okay, and our exhaustion is full. Uh, yeah, we'll just get the whole... S we'll get five. We'll get five hours of sleep. And that should take our health up pretty high because that'll be the full five hours of the, of the drugs and take our exhaustion down quite a bit. And then hopefully our hunger doesn't max out so we have time to go someplace and find some food. Okay, okay. That has come the most pressing endeavors of the day were fulfilled at the expense of several lives of your bound. A mime performance at the expense of several lives of your bound. A mime performance at the theater will feature today's events. Okay, 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 okay. This might be, we might still be okay. We might still be savable. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Hold on. We're going to do one more thing. Now we do. Uh, now Can we do you feel how rapid my heart this, is. and we do one more. That's got our health up. Okay, and that should secure it. Okay, we're gonna save here. 
I'm gonna save there. Okay. Okay. Time is definitely a huge, a huge issue. Time is definitely a huge issue with this for sure. Oh wait, are we losing it? Oh no, no, okay, we're good, we're good. All right, yeah, so that's day two, or is that? Day three is down and we're now on to day four. We, we took a couple of losses there. We were able to recover. I think we're okay. We've got a lot of money. We've got a lot of resources, like bullets and, and stuff and lots of stuff we've gathered. If if we can stick with this, if we can if we can stabilize after this, we're still we're looking good. We're not we don't have any disease. Our hunger's high, but our health is high. Our exhaustion's low. Our immunity is I think at, at half or better. We're doing okay. Basically, what we're gonna have to do is we're gonna have to run and get some food right away first thing next week when we get back to this. All right, uh, let's transition back over to this. Call her quits on that. All right. That was a, a very active, very interesting uh, play playthrough for this one. Oh, so guess Ika, friend. Uh, I call. I'll, I'll call you a friend. I hope that's okay with you. What percentage of players do you think made the achievement of making it through day three? Now, if you remember right, people who made it through day two are eleven point one percent of players. That's your hint. What percentage of players made it through day three? What do you think, Ika? Do you have a guess for us? Any guess? Any guess? I know I have a delay, and I know I'm having a little... 6%. 6% is a pretty good guess. Not too far off. Uh, the correct answer is... 8.9% of players have this achievement of making it through day three, which is called Look For Me Elsewhere. Um, yeah, so 8.9 players have made it past day three of this particular learning module. That's uh, pretty, pretty crazy. Um, yeah. Yeah ton of shiny achievements after this yeah the level three was a, the day three one was a shiny achievement is it anything under 10 percent? is that how it works i don't know how these shiny achievements work but um but also uh, of course now that we've done this we don't do what did we learn because it's the weekend and i'm being lazy on my weekends uh, i uh, punish me if you must but um I think anything under 10%, yeah. Okay, cool. Um, but I will do the the the, the plugs. So uh, Tuesday, we will be continuing our playthrough of Dark Devotion. Um, a funny YouTube video on the Discord, by the way. Oh, I'll definitely check that out after I finish. I wrap up here. There's a couple things I want to check out. I've got your YouTube video, and then I think uh, OSR uh, posted a clip over there. I need to check that out, too. Um, but Tuesday, Dark Devotion. We're continuing that 4 p.m., um, I have no idea what's what's going to happen. I think we, we've got the boss fight for Area 3 to do, which we should be able to do on our second try. I should have gotten it on my first try, but the, the enemy stun locked me into death from like half health. So, womp womp. Uh, but so hopefully we should move on past section Area 3 into Section 4. See how far we get into that in, in our in our evening. Uh, no promises, no guarantees on what I can do there for uh, at all. But we'll, I'll do my best bet. Then... Um, as we talked about earlier, if you were here, that boss just like hit you into a chain of hits, didn't he? Did they? Yes. They had that power where they dropped the skulls on you, the green skulls, and it knocks you back into the next skull. And he does a chain that la goes the full length of of the stage. So the first one hit me and it just chained me to death hitting over and over and over again. There was nothing I can do. I had him at one hit point. Like one more hit and I would have won over. It was just bonkers that it... It got me, but whatever. Try to. We will definitely get him. No problem. He was not a hard boss. The bosses in that learning module in general have not been super difficult. Generally. Generally speaking. There's been one or two that have been more difficult than others, but generally not too bad. Um, let's see. And then Thursday, uh, as we mentioned earlier, we did finish up Dead State Reanimated Edition. Um, definitely go over to the YouTube and check out and see how that went. Um, yeah. 
It was definitely a hard push there at the end, but we got it done. 109 hours or whatever it was. Um, we will be starting Battletech, the uh, mech turn-based space adventure. Something, something completely different story and universe and visual wise but still in the turn-based genre i think so i think it's a good juxtaposition of seeing a, a different kind of turn-based uh learning module oof instant kills suck although funny enough one of my most favorite learning modules has two bosses in it that can instant kill well you were telling me that um was it undertale undertale has a couple of instant kill boss fights or something right um, and then, of course, next week, 3 p.m., we will be continuing our playthrough of Pathologic Classic HD, see if we can get through day four, see what percentage of people have made it through day four if we manage to pull it off ourselves. It will be super, super interesting. Um, please give us the follows over on um, uh, YouTube. We've got to please subscribe. Uh, Raven Hillbrook Inc. over there. Uh, Hillbrook is one word and Inc. I-N-C -I like incorporated. Um, and the links for that are in the chat and on the, uh, the info page here on Twitch. Um, any likes, subs you know, likes, subscribes doesn't actually unless you go into the super low level or just don't have enough HP. Oh, oh okay. Uh, but yeah, likes, subscribes, uh, upvotes, shares, any of that super great. Um, follow us on discord or join the discord i guess i should say uh links for that are in chat and on the info page uh as we've just talked about we post uh oh, we're we got a nice little fairly active little fan group over there uh more the merrier is always great invite your friends uh tell them you know tell them what we're doing over here and then of course follow us on twitter uh at hillbrook inc it um i uh we we put out Updates about the stream, if something changes, little friendly reminders of what what's being played and when, and of course other random things that the company wants to put out uh, that they thinks the board members should know about. So please join us over there. Um, I think that's about it. Uh, let's see. But lots of them could one turn you even if you're a decent level. Oh, okay. Well, that's, I mean, boss fights, right? Boss fights are always weird. But uh, board members, thank you again for stopping by on a, on a busy weekend, or well, not a busy weekend, but over your your weekend, which is precious, precious time. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Like I said, let people know, let other board members know, and have them come in. Actually, there's two guys that can insta kill you, but you're not supposed to fight them. Well, you know, if you pick a boss, uh, you pick a fight with someone you're not supposed to fight, and then yeah, the learning modules have a tendency just to kill you flat out. Um, but. Uh, Yep, yeah, I'm going to go enjoy the rest of my weekend, relax the rest of the day, do my uh, third job uh, tomorrow morning, and then relax after that. I hope you all have a good weekend. Again, I thank you for all stopping by. Ika, you have an, uh, a nice night, too. Good rest of your weekend. Um, ladies Intro, if you're out there, OSR, or any of the other board members, I hope you have a good rest of your weekend. I hope to see you back Tuesday. I'm going to go ahead and uh, clock out now. Bye.